one, go. Welcome to Store Week Night 3. Enter the warehouse. Jesse? You didn't tell me you were going to do that. Okay. Well, anyway, Crenton, 20 months, welcome back. Give me a baby's head. Okay. Support of Ancients, 15 months, welcome back. PJK, tier 2, 3 years. Happy Stream wow, welcome thank back. thank you. Uh, thank you so much, everyone. More importantly, I mean, you guys are important, obviously, but our friend Dan is here. Hello, Dan. Hey, hi. How are you? Okay, sort of weird energy. Love that energy off the top. And I, I got to say also, Stefan, way to set it up by saying he is either more or less important than the people in the chat. I mean, just an outrageous Sort, sort of way. up to you to decide. I think I think it would have to be uh, a more Attention important, Attention shoppers, right? for today only, the store is offering its value uh, customers yeah. a chance oh, to win yeah. a free Hold PlayStation I don't, 2. I, I need to make if it you so you guys can hear the sound. Right, it's one free second. PlayStation 2 in Do chat. You? Yeah. Please come to our customer service desk I, to claim I your prize. Quiznos Iraq, 34 months, welcome back. Real Kevin James, two years. 
It's got to be orange. It's got to be thick. It's got to have the consistency to kind of sit on the plate. Then if you try and move it, it's like a mound trying to move. It can't be loose, that type of thing. Kevin James, welcome back. Two years. Bing, Jess, Jesse bing, left again, I think. That's cool. Yeah. A reminder uh, to shoppers that nope. the deli slicer is available for staff use only. Yeah. Please do not bring home cooked chicken breast to the store to this slice is specifically it on our deli directed slicer. at Jesse, I think. It doesn't well, work. Yeah. It turns he, into a shredded mess. Yeah. yeah. You you know. Know. <laughs> he had a big it's ticket purchase in the works. Thank you. It didn't go through, Bing. I don't think. Nay, you jeez. Bing, bing. <sighs> Thank bong. you. Stephen to the kanji counter. Yeah. Need mop and bucket at the kanji no, I, counter. I know. Okay. Well, he, here, you already heard this one, Dan. This is the new parody song I did. Yeah, I did. I'm at the oh, store. I'll never say that anonymous. I'm at the checkout. I am putting all my stuff down on the belt. The cashier says hello. And he asked me if I want a paper bag. Mm -hmm. But I brought a bag from home. Not where I was thinking. I brought you know, a bag from with the title. home. What is this? Can you tell me what it is? There's zero chance you know this I'm song. At the this is uh, The Old Man's Back Again by Standing Scott Walker. With my phone. Is that the I Wisconsin governor or whatever? It is. Before he busted unions, he was in the Walker Brothers. Yeah. And, uh, How would I like to pay? And then it got weird. Would I like is this the kind of stuff you guys listen to when you're in the car and stuff? This is charity. Dave Thorpe music. This yeah. is uh, yeah. Yeah, this is a Dave Thorpe I'm act. actually good today. I'm actually good Jesus, today. Jesus, how long is this? It's a minute 15. Yeah. Oh my god. But I made it a bit Brussels more expensive. Are gonna be done. <laughs> oh, fuck. Jesus Christ. Okay, you gotta go get your Brussels sprouts. That was so long, I have to take the Brussels sprouts. Okay, out of wow. The okay, well, th why don't you go do that? Okay, uh, I'll be right back. I hate the store. Welcome. Please ban that account. Thank you, Anonymous. Four mommies, one me. 14 months. Welcome back. You have got to be God. kidding me. Welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Uh, Big Cinnamon Bun, 42 months. Quiznos Iraq, 34 months. Real Kevin James, two years. Deppy Slide, 56 months. And uh, Real Kevin James, uh, happy stream anniversary, two years. Pizza Lawyer, 29 months. Oh, great, here's Nick, 73 months. Can Contra, 15 months. PJK, tier two for three years. I think we're all caught up here. Here we I go. I think we're almost there. Scott, and Scott, Scott Walker, Walker versus, versus Jason X. Welcome. Thank you, Deputy Slide. And Jesse, for our fans, Europe. Welcome. Thank bit. you, Omnivore. Thank a you. A good bit recognized. Thank, Thank you. you. Bugin. And there's a good bit from Nay, Mars. Geez. Thank you, Mars. Geez. Thank you, Spence. <laughs> All right, hype train level two. Our friend Dan is here. I mean, he's checking out his Brussels sprouts right now, but I did not see the uh, Dwayne go off for Mac. You better get the Dwayne oh, going. Oh shit! You're right. I'm sorry, Mac. Just a sec. I, I well, apologize. it should just be in the folder where it auto starts when the, your computer starts up, Stefan. Well, Jesse, as you know, this this thing doesn't work that way. For, <laughs> it's like the one program that doesn't work that way for some reason. I know. I know. It's My really. Go it's, back I I point. have it in the folder. It's you know. Uh, I know. Just doesn't work. Okay, here's a Dwayne. God, you know what? Should I wait until Dan gets back for the Dwayne? Yeah. yeah. Novaru, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Self checkout machine, welcome. Thank you, T. Thank the you, Randy. The pitbulls do work during. Yes, the pitbulls do work. Hell, but just keep pit... in mind. <laughs> Sorry. These these pitbulls. Uh, these pitbulls are uh, the medical. What, what do you call those ones where you can bring them in the store and just let them do whatever the Still hell you want? Support animals. Yeah, those those pit bulls are support health mentally healthy support. This is this are. is my support animal. Hell yeah! <laughs> <laughs> don't touch the dog. Seriously, don't. No, get, get, don't touch the just, dog. You know, in fact, everyone else has to leave the store while I'm in here with yeah. this dog because he's just gonna just fucking freak the fuck he's out. Very supportive to the point where it's like it's gonna be a problem for you guys. Yeah. Thank you, Randy. <laughs> okay, this is Randy's service dog, Game Boy and Nebula. <laughs> That's pretty cool. But Game Boy is Randy's service dog, and then Nebula is Game Boy's service dog. <laughs> <laughs> that one kind of had a gremlin-y look to it. It did. It did. Let me... Hold on. Okay, uh, Big Red and Chloe. We are... We're, the oh, there we go. The, cousin Skeeter, song. there you go. There you go, Cousin Skeeter. Is that, is that you in the, yes. the disco? I hope you're I, I happy. it is. <laughs> there you go, Cousin Skeeter. <laughs> and thank you, Mitch, for this. I, uh... I can't sing at all or even fake singing, but I thought I was trying to work out. I don't care, by the way, that Mitch's thing is playing right now. Um, <laughs> you, could do, you could do a song, I think. Well, I was thinking of um, 
You know the Doors Riders on the Storm? Okay, uh, yeah, where are we going with this? Well, let's you know, we prices at the store. Oh. And we oh. Know something like, no you know? Prices at the store is really good. I can't do a Jim Morrison voice. I'm, uh, well, I'm trying to think. It's like, uh, prices on the store. Yeah. Yep. That's really Very good. high, of course. You oh, know. my God. I mean... The, it's, there it is. So you you got it. You hit it. The other one was the doors, the crystal ship, the apple crisp. You know, something like that. Yeah, really good. That's uh, really good. I look. I gotta say, I I have no interest in Dinosaur Junior. But hearing Mitch's rendition does make me want to run to the nearest record store and check them out. That's, what, yeah. what I mean, what album are we recommending? Isn't it true that actually you're so old, you're Dinosaur Senior? Hmm, that's interesting. That's yeah, really actually, the last time I heard that joke, I fell off my dinosaur junior. So, yeah, because you were a baby. Yeah, I was. I was too small to go on it. You're, he, you're, he is the baby. Gotta love him. Yep. Well, you don't actually have to love me. Is sort of what I've noticed in that, in that case. So anyway, guys, look, I haven't been on. I can't. I was trying Thank to think. Mitch. I can't remember the last time I've been on the stream. Oh, mm -hmm. Dan, that actually reminds me. You just got back. We owe a Dwayne. Would you like to kind of check in on our friend Dwayne? This is for you. This, this is, is for this, you, Dan. This I was Dwayne literally in the middle of talking. <laughs> this, this Dwayne is for you, Dan, and it might be really loud. So sorry. Oh, actually, I don't think he talks in this one. God, I love interrupting Dan for <laughs> that specifically. Fuck, what a payoff. Sinatra, should, not should, simping. Welcome. I mean, Thank you, Ballista. Do you want to talk about what happened before we went live? Okay, and licking the tip. Welcome. Thank you, little stinker. I just hung up. They Jesse started. I just hung up the call. I was like, yeah, fuck it. I'm not going to do it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, why and was that? He, he begged me like a dog to come back. <laughs> yeah, begged me like a dog. <laughs> uh, he said, Dan, I'm so sorry. The other thing is, I'm doing this as a favor because you're, the guest you had for tonight dropped out, uh, and it was a huge get for you. I don't know what I P. Drop Diddy... comments down below. I love P. Diddy, asking I guess, you guys directly else... there. It's a lot well, of fun. So definitely make use of that on. stuff, guys. It was P. Diddy, Diddy and then continue to have that backup game. guest I was... I believe Cuba Gooding Jr. was your second. And then third, uh, third was uh, Joe Lieberman. <laughs> And Joe Lieberman was was third. Well, yeah, yeah. We, we, we were, thought so. for sure with those three guys we'd have One a of good them. show. Yeah, we were gonna play right. Gartic phone with those guys. God, it would have been so funny to get well, Lieberman on here. Now you have to like that old voice that he had. Oh, uh, would now be you fun. have to uh, follow the maze or what? Right? Doesn't he sort of? <laughs> <laughs> no one here knows what he sounded like. I think that's. I, sort of, I would imagine right, he sounds like that. Right, yeah. But this way, that's what I recall. He sounded like twenty years ago. Right. Oliver, was running. We, we never went to a freak-off event at Booby Hunt on the Swamp. I just want to be clear. I did wear a bad boy hat. Well, yeah, that was, that was to let people know that, that was JF was in town and was going to be going to the store. <laughs> uh, thank you, uh, Gary, for the peep. Uh, and thanks, everyone, for the hype train. I, we should do a Dwayne where he actually like says something, I think. That but, would be but nice, But, Dan, go, yeah. go ahead. Do you have anything else to say? That's what, such what a hostile you, thing to ask. Oh, what is? Oh, oh, <laughs> I hate you guys. Why do I come on here? I mean, you guys, you guys don't like me. So like, I'm on you your stop. side. No, no, no. Jesse's no. reading a like fucking me. newspaper right now. He's not even reading a newspaper. Oh, it's like He's it's not like a newspaper. It's like a He's flyer. reading the coupons. Yeah. What store is that? Coupons in here. What store is that? Um, well, I, I want to say this came in the package from our friend Dr. Remulak, who I, I don't know if you're in the chat right now, but thank you so much for the oh, care wow. package you sent along of fantastic uh, uh, Wawa and Philly area Ooh. snacks and treats. So Ooh, I got a lot of great yeah. stuff that Mike and I went through on the... Um, you get any uh, You get any Johns in there, JF? I got some Johns in there, yes. Okay. I did. Right. Hey, he's here. Thank you, Dr. Remulak. It's really, really chips? nice of you. Uh, absolutely. Um, mm -hmm. And... Tasty cake. Dan, were you a tasty, tasty cake, cake guy? Uh, I've never... I think I had it once. I know it's a Philly sex? snack cake. Was it sex you had once? <laughs> just wanna, hey, sorry, I just want to respond to Perry in the chat who says, Dan, just want to say, it's nice to hear from you again. Hope you are well, and I just want to let Perry know you are not well. <laughs> you are in... You're having a tough time. Okay, he left the call again. <laughs> <laughs> well you know what let's play a Dwayne as like a siren call to get him back in here okay he's gonna want to jump back all in right, here, here we go i'm playing that. a Dwayne. this is dan you got here just in time we're playing another Dwayne for you okay yeah Demon. 
Oh my, my god. Demons. Okay. But I'd like to be them. Yikes. Yeah. Let yeah. me tell you why. Pretty good. Uh, kind of a uh Kind of a Tim Burton, late career Tim Burton character. Yeah, don't sort you, of. Yeah, don't you see late, that? Yeah, he reminds late. me of the woman from uh, Big Eyes or whatever. Yeah, this the, is the, the famous Beetlejuice painter. sequel. Yeah, you know. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> well, we'll have to see on that. You see, hey, so you know the, uh, the hey kids, I'm back. <laughs> Did you guys watch the trailer for the yeah. new one? I didn't. So what's the what's the song like the, the Deo? Yeah, Deo. Mike was just asking me this earlier today. What is the song that they slow down for the trailer Dude, and we couldn't think I of it? I couldn't fucking believe... Like, that's a that's like something that you would make up. Hey, in the Beetlejuice 2 trailer, they're going to do a slowed down haunting version of Deo. I know. And they actually did it. I mean, I always was proud of my joke of, like, a kid is going it a into... I don't think it's a bit. Is it a bit? No, a kid going into a dusty attic and finding the Austin Powers penis enlarger pump. <laughs> yeah. That is, yes, that yes. is you very know, funny. Like, yeah. what, what was Grandpa like? Well, he was very, you know, and then, <laughs> like, yeah, wiping off the dust. Yeah. It, I think it, is, it, is, it is daylight coming. We want to go home. That's what it yeah. is. I mean, may, I, I think there's room for that to be ironic, probably, but it's just like, man, also like. I don't think so, man. Given like recent tim burton output i don't know yeah you know uh god just yeah. 23 months uh i hope you're enjoying tokyo i have a hernia Ooh, 50 wow. months welcome back the big five oh store manager welcome thank you bonky donors and little stinker thank you for the gifts that once again to squirming tongue 51 yeah what Man, is it hmm? no no you go i was just gonna say uh, is is tim burton known for being highly ironic i don't think so i i wouldn't say so no not really right um, I was thinking though to the subscriber who is in Tokyo right now. Yeah. Yes. Uh, stop watching the stream. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? No, Turn it no, off. no, no. Come on. Go do something else. Go do anything else. Walk out the door, and there's going to be something interesting. We're actually playing on one of those big uh, screens. At the, the, in the big, yeah, in Shibuya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Shibuya scramble, and it's it's Jesse's big face. And... Yeah. <laughs> Come on, my face isn't big. Well, it's big on the screen. It's big on the side of yeah. the building. Yeah. Okay, hey, Savage well, Gordon, that's... 66 months. Welcome back. Thank you, Pat. Hurtful. Pat with a good prequel hey, idea and here. And Beetlejuice pops up. He's like, Gaijin, you hate him, right? You know? <laughs> Pat's idea for a fat bastard uh, prequel where he's skinny and there's a lot of really tense scenes where he's left alone with a baby. <laughs> That's good. I like that. That could right. be good. I guess I he, he's, I he's like, skinny now, right? Isn't he? You need to have a system for these anonymous gift subs. I don't have... We, there's nothing we can do about that. Okay, well, There's I, nothing you can do about anonymous gift you're giving a tier one sub to Dan the Pedo Man. First oh, off... Well, that's on Twitch. Why is that, an, why is that an account on Twitch? That's on Twitch. With? That's on Twitch. I didn't know which one you had a problem with. Dan is right. Well, well, Welcome. Well, I... Okay, that one I gifted... <laughs> To myself. Uh, <laughs> just to... Uh, boy, all right. Because, well, anyway. you know, I am right. I'm, like, always right. And you guys are such fucking assholes to me. <laughs> me? Yeah, you. <laughs> I think I've always been respectful of you, maybe even more respectful than you deserve. <laughs> so, I've always... Now, why, why would that be? I've always Break gone out of my Daniel way. Long. Thank you, Anonymous. Thank Even you. when you don't necessarily deserve the benefit of the doubt, I feel like I've always extended I've got to you. hear this. Oh, no, no, no. Go on. Hey, Dan the Big Dog, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. There, you there we go. Okay. That's still me. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, no, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. Well, no, look I'm at just this. Kidding. I don't have $5. What were you saying? I got this circular from... Oh, uh, yeah. We were talking Tasty Cakes. Yeah, yes. taste, yeah, yeah, your, your, your can, thoughts. Can I counter with one thing, which is yeah. um, growing up on Long Island, the equivalent would have been uh, there'd be. Nay, ye geez. Really? That was from Dune, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. the, by the way, could you keep track of how many prophecies uh, Atreides was fulfilling? Uh, <laughs> it was like three different things. Look, the golden path and all that. Look, it's a lot. It's a lot. It, it was like uh, the resume. I'm the Heidegger, the Heidegger Sizerak, but I'm also 
I'm also this thing, and I'm also this third thing. Doing like a doing like a Jay Leno monologue about <laughs> the Atreides <laughs> is really good. <laughs> hey, here's something. You think that's here? There's a guy named Baron Harkonnen. You think that? <laughs> yeah, you heard about this? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh boy, Dan with a beard, welcome. Thank you, Deppy Slide. And honestly, the, the episode two, Dan the, the Mil Dan the Milf Hunter, welcome. Keep going. Nine says, can Dan talk a little less? Why would I be? You know what? I'm no. fucking. I'm done. No, no, no you're not. No, because no, no. there's no. more gift subs. Dan the God, welcome. Dan is That's rich nice. now, welcome. Th uh, thank you, Bob. Wow, that's owners. good news. This uh, is time for taxes. Dan, Dan, the mattress man, oh, welcome. Thank oh. you, Devin. Let's talk about that. Dan, I, handsome I, man, I, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. This is getting actually Brave Dan, welcome. Direction. Thank you, Pat. I know. Ty Dan, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Wow. I'm curious. Dan, uh, the piazza I, man, welcome. Thank I you, wanted Anonymous. to talk about Dan, the piazza man. Now, do we think... Do we hmm. think this is... Like, he really loves piazzas in Italy, or more likely... Mike Piazza. Got to be, got to be Mike catcher. Piazza. I think, yeah. Right. Well, you were a Mets fan, weren't you? I was, and I, I saw Mike Piazza play once. Wow, Subway Series. And I saw Rock and Robin Ventura, who famously got his ass kicked rushing the mound. Oh. Okay. Wow, a lot of history there. Ah. Dan loves movies. Welcome. Thank you, T. Sit on my face, Dan. He does. Welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Dan in my pants. Okay. Welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Sit, sit on my face, Dan. That was from Jesse. That one that, was from that's Jesse. That's definitely from Jesse. That's not. Sexy Dan. Welcome. Thank you, Hush. Dan O'Sullivan, aspiring comic. Welcome. By the way, all the money is going to them. It's not going to them. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Well, you have to scream if you want the money, Dan. We've gone, we've gone over this. Yep. You have to get on the computer. Yeah, Dan's massive true. rod. Welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. Wow. Um, I wanted to talk about... Jeez, we're like three topics behind here. Yeah. I know, well, this I is how say, it goes. Dan is my dad, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. On Long Island, the equivalent snack cakes would have been uh, Entenmann's. Right. Uh, and then also um, uh, Drake, which I don't know. Um, oh, he's, he's kind of... He, he's... Shut up. Stop. Stop. I, say I knew that. you were going to say that. Let's just Let's just... <laughs> Say that you said it, and we'll move on, okay? Dip okay? it in the bud! Okay. Right. But Drake had ding-dongs. Or no, ring-dings, excuse me. Um, was ding-dongs another one? Anyway. Ding-dongs is hostess, I think. Hostess I think is ding-dongs. Right. Yeah. Their equivalent was ring-dings. Yeah. Right. And they were superior. I'll say are that. They, are all of the snack cakes Hello, brands go off King Shoppers. zombified? Okay. We have okay. Thank you. A small Thank you, uh, Matt. Of the bell Dan's big uh, booty, welcome. Thank you, Tony. Have they all been killed off and it brought back? You mean like, uh, like that happened to Twinkie, right? Just a man's Twinkie all went away for a little bit no and then involved. came back, yeah. It all of us. Like somebody must right. have come into Big the Dick bell Dan, welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. And the seed. And it was actually like kind of a like a corporate bell pepper baby, right? Well, yeah, they were unionizing. Oh, is that actually why? A beard, I, as I a recall, really yes. High I think that there was some bald, stock scam behind hair, it, right? Oh, yeah. I mean, that wouldn't, you look at the hairline, that wouldn't surprise me. Anyway, yeah. yeah, Hostess, yeah. And then it was brought it back like in that way that, like, Toys R Us or any of those other places are ever brought back, right? Yeah. Right, some, some guy, Mitt Romney, bought them. Please come to the produce section to pick up your bastard bell pepper Now, Demi, as I've said before, you have somehow now sent two... Separate alerts that are actually impossible yeah. to download. Yeah, because you're recording them directly into the app that you're trying to communicate with, which renders them into a file type that's unusable outside of said app. Um, which, you know, normally I would take any chance I could get to jump all over Stefan, but in this case, I think he is right. Thank you. Yeah, oh, Zemi, uh, what did you send? The knock list from Mission Impossible, where we need the other half to fucking decode it? Well, hey, that's also the that's sort of the MacGuffin of the new one. Did you see the new one? I didn't see the new one. The new one's actually. a lot of fun. New they do the same fun. exact thing in that yeah. one. <laughs> so. You know what? If it ain't broke. Yeah, I know. Yeah. It's it's really good. It's good. Oh. And they they do. I don't. It's not ruining anything to tell you. And I'm sure you've. No, hit me with it. Come on. So, so I was just taking in uh, producer Dan's gift sub to pubes the size of weeds. A lot going on well, in producer hey, Dan's I, place hey, right now. Dan. You looking at your bathroom floor? No, Don't that, talk that to Dan about his bathroom floor right that's now. That's covered he in uh, asbestos right now. So, I mean, really. <laughs> I'm at the store. Hey, thank Prayers you, Dark Web. Man. Thank you. I'm at the checkout. Thank you, Dark Web.
And thanks, Dirk. I okay. am putting all my stuff. So we are in the warehouse. The yeah, and I can't reverse in this thing. The cashier oh, wait, yes, I can. Hello. Who are you, Glenn Greenwald? Can't, me um, oh, you've gone too far in one direction. And yeah. Now sort of, yeah, sort of stuck. Are, are, are we talking about Z Zion? But Zion. I brought Zane. a bag from home. What? What's that what? little guy's name? What, who are you talking about? Gone too home. far in one direction. Oh. oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Zion? I'm at the checkout. I don't know. <laughs> Zion? Let, let me phone. explain the Glenn Greenwald joke, because it didn't really I work. Go ahead. I Go ahead. I was just, I was trying to say, like, he's Skin a guy who never, stuff. he can be wrong about anything, he won't apologize. Like right. But it didn't quite land. I, no, I, I, I think I got would it. Would I like no. to give a dollar I respect him. to charity? Okay. <laughs> Maybe we should move on. <laughs> actually good Thank you, Cram. Today. Okay, here we go. I'll tell you I'm what I like about that guy. Today. He defended Nazis. That's what was so good about it. <laughs> uh, now, Stefan, we talked recently about... I had a fantasy briefly for a little while. Yeah. About becoming a forklift operator. Yeah. Mm. And honestly, it's still, having done my taxes today, ah, boy. Uh, it's still in the mix, you know? Yeah. Yeah. It was fun um, when, I, when I, I, it was honestly a very enjoyable job. Mm-hmm. Um, how long did you do, this is what blew me away. Do you know how long he did it for, Dan? Like it was six, a long six time, or seven right? years? Yeah. What the fuck? I first knew you when you were working at the, um, the toilet factory. It was toilets, right? Yeah, yeah. I mean, that is uh, somehow not a joke. No. Producer Dan, thank you for banning taxes. And Dan, 1-870-220-133-262. Welcome. Thank you, Anonymous. If you come back to Twitch, that's going to be your username, right, Dan? All right. Can can you stop mentioning that? Uh, let me talk about why I haven't been streaming. One, I'm a teacher now. Yes. Congratulations. Well, you're upset because they won't let you show your booty hole on here. Well, there is also that boycott occurring. I mean, this is unfortunate. Um, so it's brutal being a teacher. Yeah. Um, but also, uh, and not a real teacher, I should be clear. I'm not stealing valor here. Okay. Not like a full-on teacher, right. you know? No, you're stealing school supplies. <laughs> have, I, have I stolen? I haven't stolen school supplies. Wow. I don't know uh, how to... I, it, doesn't, it didn't show me the controls for this. I actually don't know how to do this. Hand-cutting knife, six months. Welcome back. Thank you. Um, Deppy Slide, it's elementary school, so I'm not gonna, I, I can't show Kiss Me Deadly to a bunch of kids. Right. And expect them to get it. I'm just not gonna, not gonna happen. But then the other thing is, mm -hmm. I've been waiting forever for this other project to finally take off. Guffman and, uh, finally gonna show up. We think. Huh. You, there is zero chance you've seen that movie. I have seen it and I hated it. I just want to be clear here. Did you really? I just want to be clear yeah. here. There are I'll fuck with that. there are no controller settings whatsoever in this entire game. Yeah, well, it's it's like, what's the controller setting going to say? Don't operate the forklift. I mean that. Or yeah, do operate the forklift. So it, it gotta be do. Yeah, it puts me. On, I'm just gonna I'm gonna go to free play mode here. I think. Okay, it's gonna be the same thing basically. Oh my god. Can someone can someone look up the controls for this, please? What is it called? What's the name of the game? Well. It's called Warehouse and Logistics Simulator 2014, I think. 2014, that's a little bit out of date, isn't it? It's a little bit, yeah. Um, okay. Let's do, okay, we'll start the game here. Uh, here's a thread on the Steam community page. It says, controls, question mark, how to lift the goods up. Yes, that's what I need to know. Blakey Rat says, I just tried this game myself. I hit literally every key on the keyboard, every mouse button, tried shift key, <laughs> control yeah. key, nothing. Yeah. There's no help menu. There's no controls configuration. There's no readme in the Steam apps directory. What the hell? The only thing I found is that backspace makes your forklift do a little jump. It does? Okay. Okay. Uh, follow up here from a different user it says, try up and down arrows. Okay. They seem to control the lifting, and one through three changes the camera angle. WASD moves, but you probably knew that already. Okay. Also, if you hit F1, apparently that displays the controls. Okay. Oh my god, where'd he go? There we go. Okay. Here we are. Okay. There we go. Good oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Okay. Okay. All right. 
Is it? Cooking. Wait, yeah, there's no one. Okay, this is a little. Well, you it's theater of the mind. Have you uh, tried hitting the forklift button? Well, hold on. Let's see. What were the spaces break? Okay, tilt fork backwards. That's good to know. Bugin, nay, you jeez. Yep. Okay, um, move stacker. Oh, that's just this. Okay. Did you read the, like, the comments on this game? No. When will this company stop pumping out these games? Are people really buying them? Sure, some of them may be decent, but it seems like they are just taking the simulation genre too far. Oh, well. People keep buying these, and they will release this stuff forever. Yeah. Yeah. Sort of sad. Ten years ago. Yeah. Yeah, this is, this is, this is more of a pallet jack than anything else, I think, but... Having a boring day and want to hate another game in your library? Well, step right up. Oh, well, they moved the fucking pallet. This is not normal. This is not normal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Your score is zero right now. I understand. Here lies Stefan. <laughs> Thank you, Rally. <laughs> empty fridge, I promise to buy food. Don't look in the crisp. I really the like this one. Thank you, Dan. Thank you. You're Heading welcome. Heading to the Safeway, buying some stuff. Buying some stuff. Buying some stuff. Buying now, who's some this stuff, song by? Buying this is Radiohead. This is I keep Radiohead. Going to Radiohead. The store, but the price goes up. I don't really mind. I just want to eat samples from a plastic cup. Feel like a cheapskate if I don't okay, so we can do this. buy organic. But I honestly don't mind. I just love to shop. There we go. There we go. Okay. Thanks, Rally. Looks like you can uh, redeem 400 choice points for a free ham. I'm trying to talk about the deal. Okay, well, this is... <laughs> hey, thank you, Dark Web. This is from our friend Demi. The sky thank people you. are coming, so we better ride our birds. Fuck. We'll get to go oh, and weave one, a, yeah. a new body off the wood. The you know mother this song tree too? is glowing, do, so yeah. Awa won't let us fail. I'm fucking my big blue wife with my sexy ponytail. Sexy pony I think I'll stick it later into that big crazy whale. The sky people don't stand a chance when they launch their attack. I mean, fairness, I'll shoot them down with my eyes. arrows. Because I'm big blue cat, I'm big blue cat. Yeah. yeah, that's my understanding as well. All right, it's a good song. Don't get me wrong, but you know, it's it's that it's is kind there. of how the guy says it. You know. Yeah. So in this circuit, this is what pisses me off. In this circular here, I'm seeing the buy two get two free fridge packs oh, that I was telling the, you about. I mean, what a disaster that was. Dan, did you hear about this? I messed up. Man. Lay it on me. Oh. Well, I was at the store with my kiddo and. We were just going to go in and out really quick and grab one or two things. I had the basket instead of the cart. So when I have to... That was your first mistake. Well, I thought it was going to be a quick trip. No, no, no. Listen, when I go in with no basket, what's going to happen? I'm going to end up needing a basket. When I go in with the basket, I'm going to need the cart. I should just upgrade every time. It's it's true. Right? It's true. It just it caught me with I'm my just, pants down. I get, I've been there, but please go on. Thank you, Cousin Skeeter. Sorry, Jeff. Click on one I'm glad that Cousin Skeeter is happy. I'll yep. say that. Explodes. I fear I'll fail this game. I think you do and your best singing on this one. Thank you. <laughs> mode. Mode. I would love to see Stefan dressed up like Madonna in the 80s. God. The, 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 the big cones or whatever. The Ooh. breast cones. Yeah. Yeah. When you look for mines, they're yes. in a little square. Demi, I yeah. would love from the shops, I would love maybe a downloadable alert of some kind. No time to sleep. I've got to sweep. Right click a square and put a flag on there. Yeah, it's very good. Thank That's you. A very, Thank you. You did a good job. Well, anyways, head. point being, <laughs> point being, we go in and I see the, uh, which, to this Wait, point, my wife... Wait, Desperately Seeking Stefan. That would be the name of the Madonna movie. Oh, Sorry, yeah. Shoppers. yeah. <laughs> Following the resurgence of the chili... That's right, Madonna challenge. was an actor as well. Please yeah. don't yeah. forget to check that the okay, seal... The J-Lo of her time, yeah. you can imagine. ...remains intact Honestly, I, I think that's unfair to Madonna. If you notice any oh, shade thrown. Wow. Uh, well, I mean... ...rubbing their genitals on the ice cream or saying... Ooh, my willy oh so yeah, Keep an eye out for this at the store, please. please report the incident to the There's a couple of good-looking ice creams I wouldn't mind Remember, rubbing my willy on in this circular here. Willy, yeah, such as? Don't be silly. <laughs> well, we got Blue Bunny and Kemp's frozen yogurt. That sounds pretty okay. good. 
Now, Blue there, Bunny, I think of that's like a southern. Isn't that a southern thing? Isn't that a movie? I, oh, no. I thought that was. Isn't well, Texas? Okay. I don't. I. No. You know what? It, it, uh, Blue Bell is the. Blue southern. Bell. I'm sorry. That's right. Okay. Blue Bell. Uh, Blue Bunny. I'm not sure the origin, but I think they make some decent stuff there. There's also a Turkey Hill, which I want to say is southern, which is pretty uh, good. No, that is that is New York. I remember Turkey oh, Hill. Oh, really? Yeah, Turkey Hill was um, their their best ice cream was called Tin Roof Sunday. Wow. Okay. Wow. You know what? I oh, guess I thought it was in the saying south. Turkey because... Hill is Maryland. Well, I think of it as Northeast. I've not seen it outside of there. Sorry. Go I, on. I think of it as Southern because I've gotten the tea before and it's insanely sweet. So what, I who else would do that? What is the tea, JF? And Papa Horny Michael, welcome back three months. Thank you. It's like a fruit tea or something. Okay. Um, but there's another one in here I would put my wiener yes, on. Hang on. Kanji counter in, okay. in I'm, bucket I'm the heading kanji to the kanji counter. counter right now. Please. At the Easter candy oh my, in here. Sorry. Bing, bing, Can you see the reflection in the... Stefan, please. The reflections oh, uh, in, the, in the doors there bing, are really funny. Bing, Stefan to the kanji counter. That's okay. well done by in them. Yeah. Bucket at the kanji counter. Bing, they need you over bing, there right away, bong. buddy. To the I know, counter, I know, I know. You can just pick up the, the palette and get going. I know, please. I know, I know. <laughs> Blueberry, I'm looking at the Tillamook right now. Tillamook ice cream or sandwiches, two for $10. That's Ooh. a 48 bing, four bing, ounces. Bing, yeah. bing, okay, let me throw Stephen throw this at it. What's the, what's the best? The mm -hmm. the what's the best? What's the best area Tillamook's competing in? And I have an answer for this. Uh, what are they owning? What are they dominating? Having a cool name. Well, I mean, honestly, the, the, great name. Like the block of cheese. Yeah, the, the block, block of cheese is good. Is, the yeah. chat is is getting it very specifically. It's the sharp cheddar. Oh, oh wow. sharp they're, cheddar. They're owning that space in 2024. Uh, not a Sargento fan. It's it's. Um, let me put it this way: you put those two of them next to each other, and I need cheese. I'm not picking Sargento. Wow! Shots fired. I might oh, be seeing God. what's on sale. Um. Nick's ice cream or bars or Fat Boy ice cream sandwiches. Fat Boy sandwiches making its way around the country. I've noticed lately. Not heard of them. Hmm. Interesting. They look fucking good. Yeah. Uh, that sounds good. Not. The name makes you me know, think it's going to be good. I, I, yeah. I hate that. Don't I? That the marketing thing of calling something fat fucks like yeah. whatever. <laughs> it works. It fucking works. If you if you work. see something and it's called fat dumb fucks asshole idiot hot dogs it's gonna be the Food. best hot dog like, you've ever had dude there was a place in uh chicago called i think it was called fatso's oh perfect and it was such great fat guy food i remember they did mac and cheese which i know jesse's not a huge fan of no, but the other no. thing they would do was like fried crab sandwiches of all things Ooh. oh okay that's okay. last stand that's it union i wow. seven. thank you okay yeah. that sounds really good on the opposite end of things if you see something called like uh, thin guy candy, just don't Fuck even off. don't even bother. Get out of world, got the best yeah, I don't want to eat that. Hey, thank you, Mac. Here we so go. You won't be hungry after got bacon, egg, and cheese, or sausage if you please, or maybe yeah, fully this? loaded. What was this for originally? So this was for Tudor's Biscuit World. Tudor's Biscuit World. Right. Which, really how did we find it again? Could not rest. fucking tell you. No, you know who uh, maybe someone in the chat maybe had it. Maybe that's what it was. You can find your happiness. Because I think it's in. Is it in Virginia? Hello, go off King Shopper. Thank you, Serpentine. I think it is. It's really good hearing the PA announcements now that I'm actually in a store, in too. You could conceivably hear them there. Yes. Yeah. Olympia, welcome back. Just a man seed. Thank you, Olympia. There was no egg involved. It looks like somebody must have Sorry. come into the what bell was the other one you were reading? and the seed fused oh, the with the bell peppers to, to make oh, some sort of what? half bell pepper What were you reading, baby? Jesse? I'm asking you. You were in the middle of reading something. Has God and only knows. Beard, I have no clue. A really <laughs> high hairline. He's not bald. It's so far but gone, buddy. Hair, it's yeah, gone. Yeah. You, you look at the hairline. Ugh. Yeah. Anyway. I really could go for a big ass sandwich right now. It looks like he loves baseball cards oh. or something too. Hold on. Oh. Uh oh. Pot oh. Potatoes coming out. Baby, oh. Yep. Please but come to the back in. section to okay. pick I'll up your all in a second. I would love to hear about this. You already know Dan O'Sullivan's getting some potatoes, gang. Yep. Yep. All right, here we go. I think I'm doing pretty well here, Jeff. Uh, what is the objective? To bring this shit out to the parking lot. 
Sounds like you're on the ball. Thank you. Here we go. Okay. Oh, it tells you what to get right there. Yeah, I got to bring it out. You can see on the on the map there. Very well, nice. I, I guess the map is behind you, so you can't see it. But. Nah, no, but I get it. Yeah, is this sushi? What is on here? I guess it's it's cans of some kind. No, that looks like a nice uh, California roll. Pretty big, too, I think. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, so let's hear Potatoes, Brussels sprouts. Let, let me... Uh, all right. It's... I know what you're going to say. It, what is it? Roast night? Yeah, it is already because I'm on the stream. Okay, we got that out of the way. We can move That's on. That's good. I, was, I, was, say, I wasn't going to say that, to be clear. But What we can say is I had... Um, I had three veggies. Okay. Uh, in the in the fridge and on top of the fridge, we had the bag of potatoes, we had the Brussels sprouts, and we had the broccoli. Okay. And I still have leftover chicken thighs in the fridge. Mm. I'm set on my main. Okay. I needed to cook at least two of the vegetables tonight, and I thought, well, if I have the oven on, for one, I got to do it for both. That's just what I got to yeah. do. Okay. Yeah. So first. The roasted Brussels sprouts using the Ina Garten uh, mm. recipe. Okay. Oh, Jeffrey's going to love so this. So simple. So simple. Uh, toss that with a little olive oil, mm. salt and pepper, 40 minutes in there Oof. at 400. Done. Love Perfect. It. Love it. The roasted potatoes, I used the Claire Saffitz uh, recipe. Dr. Peppy, Dr. Pepper, corn DB's candy, love that. Larry. Hmm. It's oh, really... You know, we'll make it around like, to that time. It's I really think we'll have twice. to sing that. We'll have it's, to sing listen, that, too. This is the only potato recipe you're going to use. Yeah. I'm telling you that right now. Yeah. Okay? okay. Yeah. Okay. Because it's really like a double... You know, you ever have a double baked potato? Yeah. It's basically that. Okay. Okay? Yeah. Have the potatoes... All right. I do five pounds. The recipe calls for three. I do five because, you know, that's yeah, a five pound bag. Yeah. Yep. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to put two cups of water in the rim baking sheet with the half potatoes. Uh, tin foil is going to go on it. OK. Um, keep it. Keep it close to the vest. That's going to go in at 425 for a half hour. OK. Now, here's where the rubber meets the road. It comes out. It's going to rest for a little bit, which I'm doing right now. Okay. Uh, and then you're going to crank the oven up to 500. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is where we get a little hot. Okay. Okay. All right. We're going to take, we're going to drain the water. Mm. And then we're going to hit it with Caramel, a little bit of oil. I feel like is quite salt, pepper, eroticized treats. Thank What's you, this Mac. one? Absolutely, caramel okay. is erotic. Caramel Continue. is erotic. Interesting. Uh, we're looking into that. Um, <laughs> hit that with the kosher salt, the black pepper, the garlic powder. That's going to go in for 25 minutes at 500. Okay. And what you're going to have is the perfect crispy exterior of the skin. And on the inside, that mashed potato goodness. It's a double baked potato. So that's it. That's what we're doing. Shut oh the boy. fuck up, Brendel. Oh, boy. <laughs> I could oh never boy. tell Brendel to shut uh, the fuck six up. Six years <laughs> with, uh, with Brendel. Thank you, Brendel. Welcome back. Thank you, Brendel. <laughs> Brendel would fling like to me in our group, Brendel <laughs> wields so much power. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, that it would be like, remember that part where um, the bad guy in Lord of the Rings is just sweeping the crowd of soldiers? Do I remember that part? The bad I, guy? I recall. I don't, I don't, I I don't remember this shit. But anyway, you get what I mean. To me, to me, Brendel's like, uh, you, you know, in like a, in a TV show or movie or whatever, like you think like the big bad guy has been killed and then it's like, oh no. There's like his boss who's like this even scarier kind of guy, but he he seems sort of like kind of calm. But then you're like, he's the uh, he's the architect of the matrix. Exactly. Oh exactly. boy. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, and they're out of crab sandwiches at the restaurant now, Dan. Uh, Give me a baby's head. Well, I'd rather have the crab. <laughs> yeah, sandwich. I mean, Got if, it. if it's one or the other, you know. Yeah, I'll have a salad. Thank you, Mr. Dumpshit. I'll have what he's having. Remember that? <laughs> yep. Yep. Do I ever? Well, point being, uh, I missed the sale on the two uh, buy two get two, and now it's down to buy two get one, which sucks. 
but oh, fuck yeah. that. I mean, you might as well just not even go there ever again. Yeah, well, I won't be going to uh, Giant food, food, Giant Foods. So right. Okay. Okay. Can I tell you my least favorite when it's like by you three? You're not in Kansas anymore. By three, I don't know what we're doing. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, thanks, well, Big what? Howl, for the raid. What's up? Toot toot, Big Howl. Toot toot. Dan, you want to give Big Howl a toot toot? Hey, toot toot, Big Howl. Good to go. see you. There we, we go. We love Big Howl. We hey. love Big Howl. Now, Dan, you were saying, was it? A, you were saying a, there's a grocery store chain you don't like, or what was it? Jesus, we're just half listening. You just not even close. No, well, to what I, I was saying. I'm trying to do my job here. Right off the top, you get like a rush of sugar. Mm. Oh, thank you, Mac. <laughs> What's he drinking? Coconut water? He was drinking coconut water. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes. Well, so, Dan, the thing with Peep right now is that the random Peeps have been sort of weighted to... I would say hacked. I would say hacked by, by our friend DA uh, no. so that they, they are almost always going to be Market Monday uh, Peeps. If you remember his phase oh, where he was yeah. doing Market Monday, of course. So I don't, but okay. Well, for instance, it'll be something like this. So... so like, that's fitting. Game, you don't want to have it? something so crazy yeah. like that. So it you is. know what? There are a lot of choices out there. In this case, I swung on over to the aisle on the other side of aisle six. Okay. Well, so, be aisle otherwise seven. known as aisle seven <laughs> or, or aisle five. Well, yeah, yeah the for two. sure. Hmm. Depends on where you're at. Yeah. Well, sometimes it could be like they switch. They go down to seven and then they go to like deli. Oh, it's like the end of the aisle. And then it's kind of just I... like it's like an area. No, yeah. no, no, I know his ass didn't mean that. Well, no, he probably he, did. He said to a different aisle, I think, so. It wasn't that bread area that leads into the deli. It wasn't yeah. yes. that. I know it wasn't, yep. you know? We all, do, we all love that area, though, don't we? You know, I don't, I don't spend yeah. much time there. There's some nice mm. stuff there. What, what do you guys think about um, the fucking mm. big-ass uh, garlic bread in, like, the tinfoil bag? I get that. Sometimes. I love that shit. I love that shit. I, so I can't good. really have it anymore, but yeah. Yeah, but... it's. I think it's like really bad for you. Is the problem? Yeah. yeah. I think I feel very fancy and French when I get the take and bake uh, bread. Yes. I get yeah. the big loaf and I take it home. Hey, I'll take it from here. Yeah. That's kind of cool. I wanna. I wanna try something out here because I did add the smart click maps overlay, and I would like to see if this actually works. Um, now, smart clicks map overlay. That is the Canadian version of Google Maps. Is that true? Yes. Google Maps. Yeah, Google Maps. Okay. You, you guys not have Google up there? <laughs> no, we 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 do. They have Gordle. We Gordle. God damn it! It is Gordle. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna test this out. Okay. So, this is this is. I, I want to see if this works. Okay. So one of you know, one of the options here is going to be medicine, and one of the options here is going to be garlic bread, and I'm going to activate the smart click maps, and you guys are going to choose. You're going to click on these, and then whichever one you click on the most, I will get that at the store tomorrow. Wow, this is big. Do you need any medicine right now? Uh, I kind of very I, sick. I need some yeah. more allergy medication, actually. <laughs> so he's very very sick. But so. on the other on the other hand, some garlic bread wouldn't hurt either. You know. And he's a vampire. So yeah, yeah, keep that in a mind. Tough call. Yeah, we yeah. want this to go one way for sure. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to let's see if this works. Of course, this is just making me think of remember the uh, the elderly woman on Facebook accidentally posting garlic bread in the uh, <laughs> reply to her granddaughter. I don't know that I do. Uh, she. The meme, as I recall, it's not, I guess it became a meme, but it's a young it's girl that post. Happened, yeah. It started out as a it weird post, Twitter account. And then became a band. Yeah. But yeah, it was a girl saying, I want to see One Direction in their underpants. And her grandmother oh. sees it and says, no, not my fuzzy bunny milk monkey. Like she says something like that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> like, not my f Don't post that. And then yeah. immediately after that post garlic bread and then post after that. <laughs> I meant to Google that or something like. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember that part of it. That's really funny. Okay, I'm so sta I'm starting the click map right now. Let me. Is this going to work? Is this working? Garlic bread. Is it showing up? Garlic bread. Yeah. <laughs> okay, people are clicking. Okay, I can see. Is oh, it? I'm is it? Is it showing up? I'm clicking. Is it actually showing up here? Oh, uh, yeah. I guess I could do it. Let me see. 
Yeah, you can click. Yeah, you absolutely can click. That's so cool. what's so what's winning right now? Can we tell what's I winning? Think, I don't believe I can see results. That might be on your end. Uh, I've been clicking the one that won't give you medicine uh, over and over. Yeah, it looks like yeah. gar garlic bread is winning. Garlic bread is getting 100% of the clicks, which okay. I didn't think was possible. That's interesting. I'll break off one for medicine. You can only click once. One. I think you can only click once. I think. Oh well, that's oh, okay. A, a long since over then. Okay. <laughs> so then, if I go stop, is that going to show what the results were? Mm -hmm. Stefan, mm -hmm. you have been sentenced to die. I'm trying to hit on one of his teacher coworkers. You know, I'm from like five different cities Thank originally. You. Thank you, sloppy dog. <laughs> Thank why you. would you say why would you say not to go chris james here where i get uh -huh. really mad at someone <laughs> uh i don't think uh, he's ever done that no <laughs> on this stream right he hasn't um uh why would you say that that's a terrible thing to say well but you have to keep in mind he paid money to say it so yep yeah to you yeah yeah uh, yes well yeah. that's right yeah <laughs> oh okay correct um okay. now it did show it's not like showing on the screen, I guess, what the results were, though, right? If you look at the click map, does it not? Why are you asking anything. us? I'm we just don't fucking no. Hmm. Anyway, um, you know, I think uh, Andrew, Andrew Sherritt, <laughs> limited welcome. Thank you, Cash Gordon. That that was that's a, a local Vancouver um, plumbing wholesale place. So there you go. Oh wow, yeah, that's a deep cut. Thank you, Cash. Thank you, Cash. you know what else is a hmm. local uh, Vancouver production? Shogun. That's Did true. You know that? That's true. Oh. No, you can tell. You can tell. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna configure the extension here. I gotta watch that. I watched episode four of Three Body Problem today, I think. I think it was episode four. Okay. It's good. It's good. You I liked it. Is that good? It looked uh, I mean Well, I don't know. Look, you and I don't see eye to eye on any of this. We stuff. don't. No. I th I think it's not it is not as as like um uh I, they're 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 getting a little weird with it, and I like that. I thought it was going to be a real down the middle uh, piece of shit, um, but I think maybe they're maybe those guys' problems is in the uh, endings as opposed to the beginnings. So maybe it'll be maybe it'll be okay for a little while. Okay, I'm gonna try. I've I've I think maybe I have it so the click map thing will work now. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna give this a go, and I'm gonna I'm gonna start this again here. Okay, and we'll see if it actually shows up this time. I'm starting the click map. Starting the click map. Okay. Starting click map. So, oh yes, look, now it is. Now we see. Okay, so you guys are clicking on Jesse. Okay. That's interesting. Yeah. Hmm. It's okay. like, it seems to be on, it seems to be way like over my head. Even. That is not at all where I was clicking. I'll tell you that. <laughs> I'm clicking on the B for bread. Everyone's I was clicking on the G. Okay, everyone's clicking on Jesse. Okay. Okay. We, look, you can't get me at the store. I know you wish you could. Well, look, I think... So, garlic bread, I think, is... Is garlic bread winning in terms of the... Well, if you add it all up, it looks like it's something like 17 for garlic bread oh, to wait, like wait. 20 for medicine. No, way down now. 11 for medicine? Yeah, I think, I think we, go with the, we go with the second highest amount, which is 13%. Hey, uh, hey, Mike Lindell here. We have serious issues going on with the voting machines <laughs> that uh, were used to uh, <laughs> deprive me of medicine. <laughs> we can prove it. We can prove it. The Smartmatic. Uh, not here. bad. Not I, bad, you... right? Okay. God, that is that was a very good Mike Lindell. I think there we go. Okay, yes. Now it's working properly. It, the the it was set up so it wasn't fitting the screen properly. Now it should be. Yes. Okay. So th yes. It's funny how you enlarged it and it became a noose around Jesse's throat. <laughs> <you know? laughs> All right. Well, it looks like garlic bread has won this battle. Uh, thank you, Bakota. Welcome back. Thirty-one months. Thank you. It's like I Get won the paper well, balance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get some. Those are receipts. Yeah, get the receipt. We have the receipts. <laughs> <laughs> the computer is a pick, and we have. <laughs> <laughs> um, All right. looks like here. What do we got? Uh, okay, I'm looking at the deals here. And um... yeah, what do we, what do we have? What do we have? 
Um, let's see. Uh, Gal Galbani ricotta cheese. This is a bonus buy savings. Okay. So you can Galbani. Get this in- yeah. I'm trying to think uh, if I know that brand. It doesn't sound familiar to me. I don't, I don't know that I know this one either. Uh, select oh. right. You can also get the mozzarella or the ricotta. Hey, wait a minute. Give me you know baby's what? head. I get to throw this at fucking Stefan. My cat's yep. here. Oh, I have a... I'm very excited for this. I'm so happy for you and the cat. Dude. My cat just pulled this, up. This is so nice. What is your cat's name? Hey. Let everyone in the chat know. I'm not saying Adolf. that. <laughs> okay. It's not that. I don't that. think it's a good name for a cat. I really don't. Well, you named that before you knew about it. It was, it was before I knew about Hitler. I named him that. It was oh, just a bad... crazy thing. Yeah. I found out, I found out about this guy last week. Let me tell you. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like the cut of his jib. No. Nope. Thank, thank you, Mac. Thank you. Woodstock peanut butter. Huh. Never heard of that. Me neither. And Mammoth Creamery's keto frozen custard. I'll try okay, it. D- okay. Dude, these are these are sounding like the fake. Remember the fake restaurant menus we used to read like the Trina's uh oh, fucking Do you remember that Gooder's dough to go? Well, yeah, wow. I mean, T-bone tutors. Real. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna to me, I'm gonna start the uh, the click map again here. We have M and M's or kettle chips. Ooh, well, boy. wait, 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 yeah. wait. You can't go wrong, wait. really. Yeah, you can't make people choose between. Well, they're choosing which one I'm gonna buy. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. All not right. this is not like which one is better because obviously garlic bread is better than medicine. We all know that. Yes. Like, and in fact, they no work question. at cross purposes. <laughs> they do, they, sort uh, of, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm going to vote kettle chips on this. Okay. Just because well, I know how much your little ass loves them. Well, here we go. You can now, you can now click, and it should show up here. And I'm you don't need Stephen's a... You... little ass. Mm. There we go. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay, a lot, of people, a lot of people clicking on the quit button there. Okay. Some people clicking Hello Fresh. Hey, people, I like that. A lot of people closing the tab there. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. All right. Interesting. This is okay. So M and M's is uh, is ahead by. Oh no no kettle chips is ahead. Sorry, that's fourteen percent. I thought that was okay. And Jesse what? Jesse winning again. Well, quit is one winning. One fatal actually. flaw, perhaps. Hello, is go off, I... King Shopper. Uh, we <laughs> this. have discovered a small I can make It's hard to read the numbers behind the, the text that you put on the screen. Uh, yeah, section. it's unfortunate. Well, it hold on. Your fault. Fault. No, it is. Saying I can't fucking hear you. It is here. We can go like this. We can go like this. There was no egg involved. There. It looks like somebody had a come into the bell pepper. And the seed used with the bell pepper to make some sort of half bell pepper It's still not... It's still the not, bell okay. pepper baby has well, now, quite, now you got it. Okay. A beard, Quit winning a by a really lot. high hairline. He's not bald, but the okay. hair kettle not chips. Bald. That's you, right. I think kettle chips have won this round. Anyway, I mean technically quit one, but it looks like that's fine. He loves that's fine. baseball okay. cards or something. I mean, too. I. It sounds like I took the Mike Lindell voice. your baby. Please come to the produce section to pick up your master's pepper child. You know, now I don't have that to go to. <laughs> um, Rayo's uh, pasta here. Pasta now sauce. That, I- that I've had. Um, That's a good jar of sauce. Oh, I take that back. This is the and Rayo's pasta. And they make pasta. really good uh, frozen ravioli that you can air fry for 30 minutes. And don't they, get stuck on this again. Don't they, get like, stuck explode. on this again. Have you, have, Dan, have you watched, you saw that. Stop, stop, stop. You're putting me in the John Cullen role and I don't like it. You do, Okay, you're saying we, we can't watch JKM during Store Week? You're saying it, we can't watch Japanese bondage on stream? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> no, well, oh, I'd never say that. Um, I, don't th- I don't think so. That is a, uh, 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 JKM is the viewer killer. I don't think we can, we can't watch No, that you're right, video. you're right. I have no idea what you're talking about right now, but now I want to know because you... Oh, uh, this is so, uh, you, this is so you know annoying. you know jkm you know who jkm is. you saw him because you you relate to him or you know what he's the long or you are JKM. you are related to him okay I- insulting <laughs> he's the guy who gains 200 pounds over the course of him correct yes, that's right launching that yeah okay what what about him stefan just remembered something he did once he air yeah. fried ravioli is that right the rayo's ravioli specifically yeah yeah okay all right all right, we're restarting the click map. Here we go. It's between uh, entire rotisserie chicken or extra small condoms with stink guard. Did you write some of this earlier? Yeah. 
folks, I need to apply the onion. Sweet baby rays. Onions. Onions. <laughs> Uh, hey guys, the sweet baby rays. About to, that was Mark Zuckerberg, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know what? I'm so glad you said that because enough time had passed that I didn't remember that, and I got to—I really got to enjoy it anew. You know? Isn't that nice to think about? That was nice. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. uh, but really, just have a moment. I want everyone watching to just have that moment where you think about. When Mark Zuckerberg was trying to seem like a human yeah. for a while, yes. God, he has so since funny. given up. Yeah. But hmm. I might run for president. Yeah, he was trying yeah. to seem more human by running for political office. Which that, Dude, yeah. I, I remember my boss at the time said that's what he was going to do. And that was when I was living in the Bay Area. And I thought, no fucking way. And yeah. then he'd go to Wisconsin and hold a hot dog and go like, mm, I got to have my corn dog or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> really <laughs> good. Like, oh, fuck. He is going to. He is hey. going to try to do that. Okay, Condom, I mean, condoms won that round. We'll, it would we'll have had my vote. Oh. All right, I'll be right back. Hang on. Okay, so, right. so I have to get condoms, extra small condoms with stink guard. If they have it, if not, I'll just get the rotisserie chicken, garlic bread, and it was kettle chips, I think. Okay, all right. Do you have, do you have condoms? No, we don't have them up here. We call them... <sighs> don't, dodge, don't dodge the question with a joke. Gourd caps. Do you have condoms in your home? I do not have condoms in my home. Well, what do you do when you masturbate? I come on the floor. Okay. <laughs> okay. Best Rats Ever says, my, one of my coworkers tried to poach an egg in an air fryer. It didn't go well. Egg in the air fryer. That seems I like... It, I've, it, I've, heard, I've heard that works okay, but... Yeah, isn't there a way to do it, like, exactly right in the air fryer? Well, yeah, but I don't know about poaching it, though. Yeah, poaching is... I don't think you can poach it. Yeah, I don't think you poach the egg in there. But you do something with it in there, and it does something. Yes, that's right. Yeah. Oh, look at that. What's the next task? There are, at the delivery entrance, new pallets that have arrived. Within the specified time, bring the respective pallets to the locations in aisle 6A. Oh, man, this game is really boring. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna what? try I'm gonna try a different I'm gonna try a different level here. Warehouse and logistics simulator is boring. Yeah, dude. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. We got a better warehouse here. Here we go. All right. A better warehouse. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, and we got an actual forklift now too. Yes. Okay. See, this is what I'm talking about. This is the shit that I drove every day. This is what you wanted. Yeah. Well, I've heard that, uh, I, I don't know what the interface of the game is. I've only heard that it's good in relation to Bellatro. Uh, what, is, what does luck be a landlord look like? Does it look anything like this? Oh, I don't know. I've heard people talk about that. And apparently it's, not like it's a quite... sim game, I know. But no, it's like... it's, apparently that's fun. Is it, is it any, does it approximate a store feeling in any way? Is that slots, basically? Oh, it's slots. Interesting. Okay. Oh, I've heard it's good. I did uh I did one hundred percent my entire collection in Bellatro, so Wow. Now I have now my next goal is to get gold stake on every deck. And then do you know what the, the final well, I salt. Okay, you know what the final achievement is? It's so uh, when you when you uh beat uh uh like get a finish a stake with uh a specific joker, it gets a little like sticker on it, right? So if you beat one with the uh, beat the gold stake with like specific jokers, they all get a little gold sticker on them, uh -huh. and like the last achievement is getting a gold sticker on every single joker. Oh, so which is like legitimately impossible. Wait, it, uh, on gold stake. You have to beat. You have to beat. Yes, you have to beat gold stake with every joker in the game, which is like some of the jokers are useless. And right. then the harder, the crazy part for me is that there's the legendary jokers that are so rare. And also when, even when you get the card that gives you a legendary joker, you have like a one in four, one in five chance, however many there are to like get one. It's like impossible. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, you'd have to be playing that game for a lot of years, probably. Yes. Oh, Big Howl. Big Howl is sort of going after the chat here. And it's about fucking time. You are so right. Yeah. Oh, no, sloppy dog. Dan is Dan is taking care of his potatoes, which I gotta say, seems. I mean, I'm sure they're delicious, but it feels yeah. like a little bit of a fussy recipe to me. You think so? Yeah, it's too much for me. I wouldn't go through the trouble. 
Okay. Doesn't mean they're not good. I just I'm sure they're do good. All the yeah. Work. I, I like. I'm at the point where I'm like, smash the potato and then fucking air fry it, and let's get out of here. Yeah. I think you still got to boil those first. Hello, know. King Smart shoppers. We are announcing an exciting special on. Thankfully, all the structures, everything. Thank you, Dark Lab. Sorry, we have this thing where people can pay to do this, so we're just gonna have to wait this out. <laughs> uh, nerve damage type of thing that I have, yeah. that I have to kind of deal with. That's so, so funny. Um, that it is so funny. It kind of makes me feel like it, it just really, really hurts. Like it's in. We've got deals on corn. <laughs> <laughs> we love Pat. Pat, thank you so much for everything you do. I'm so oh, glad yeah. to have become yeah, acquainted Pat. with Pat. Whoever the whoever the who the fuck is Pat? <laughs> Great first time chat there too. Look, it's it's it is it is a it is a true joy. To what was the uh, the first time chat you got the other day out of someone? Uh, where they were watching for years and yeah, they didn't like two and a half years. It was someone responding positively to something someone else did. I can't remember who it was now. Was it the Well that sounds unlikely. <laughs> All right, well <laughs> Was it was it was it a Tom thing or a Mitch thing? I can't remember who it was. Somebody else had done something. It's a it's Mitch, a Mitch it's thing. It's a Mitch thing. You wouldn't You wouldn't understand <laughs> Oh my god. Ain't that Get the, the it was, fuck out of here. It was cousin Skeeter Valentine, I think. Was it really them? And now they have both. Now they have. Uh, they have enjoyed their sound alerts. But before that, they added me, or they messaged me on Discord, uh, ignored, and they added you in the Discord. Right? Yes. They've done. So they were like all up on it. Yes. Because uh, they love that. Twenty twenty four. Cousin Skeeter Valentine is going to be serving some looks. I I guess this is the new this is the new wave in the chat He's on right the come now. Up. He's on the come up. <laughs> Jesus. Yes, and then we had two more consecutive, I think, longer uh, <laughs> lurker streaks, yes. which was a lot of fun. It was a lot of good. Usually, you have, to, you, have, you have to look in your underpants usually to find those. <laughs> Goodbye. You know what? What they do have in common, though, is uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, first off, that's my bit, bitch. I came up with that. Look at uh, me. Look at me. Hey, I am the bitch now. Hey, guys. Ch Jesse, get back on screen for a second. Jesse? Why? Why? Jesse? Okay. I want to I show you something. Look, this is... Uh, people are wondering why there's no driver on the forklift. Well, this is uh, Elon Musk's latest creation, the self-driving forklift from Tesla. Check this out. Here we go. Comedy gold about the strike here. Well, the setup almost... Certainly. Yep. yep. Justifies Thank you, Mr. Musk. What happened? Yep. Okay. Well, you can't actually hit anyone in this game, right? No, but imagine you could. It, well, if actually, you, yeah. it, it seems to me, um, oh boy, being very use your time well or whatever. Did you watch the Don Lemon thing? Didn't I only saw that one clip and I was out. Oh my God, it, Oliver, our friend Bakun played it. Yes. On his. And he, I've never seen him that mad. I can't do an Elon Musk voice, but he was like, he was so Use your mad. time, use your time well, because we're out of here in a minute. He was, he was, he was flustered, but it yeah. was, I, I don't think it was so, I, I couldn't watch it. It was so awkward for me to watch. I really hate, and you it know, of course, we, I hate awkward. him. I, I hate him. So it's no, like, but so, you get that secondhand, um, I know, just Ajita from, you know, yeah. Yep. He was having a bad time, which I love. Here we go. Rocking Here we go. Out. Let's go. Hey, now. thanks, Mac. Let's go. Let's go. Now, this is something you should never do with a forklift. Is I'm gonna drive around with this all the way up. Oh, there's G Dog. Oh no. Oh no. Okay, we got some trouble here. We gotta get G Dog on a leash, gang. Yeah, I think so. Let's not be walking around with our dogs unleashed unless uh, Mike's yard is in uh, pooping range. Ah. I would definitely do it then. Um, and and maybe you don't is... even need a dog for that. <laughs> <laughs> hey, honey badger. There we go. Stefan, you, Stefan, you always got to bring the forks down. I know. I know. I'm not. Oh, I think fuck. I am a little bit lower than Stefan and further to the left. Big Howell. Yes, I think you're right. But no, no. I think I think Howell is correct about that. No. No. Hmm. No. Fuck. 
think it's just a I, little I bit. Like, I like Stefan just going at full speed with the forks up. Uh, you are not supposed to do this, by the way. Today only the store is offering oh. its valued customers a chance to win a free PlayStation 2. There you go. You the type it. Great deal. Free I would love to have that money. Great deal. Chat, please come to our customer service desk to claim your prize. It's Some actually safe to, to do this. You're supposed to do this with forklifts. You're just going to get timed out. This means forklifts are happy. When That's they right. Act like this. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay. Can I actually take this thing? Let's see. Try and get something off the shelf here. We're not fascists for not giving away a PS2. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I don't know what fascism is, but surely it's uh, not. Actually, fat. it's uh, uh, actually it's really. I'm trying to. Who would? Have, oh, Matt Taibbi. Uh, actually, it's really. Uh, it's really a free speech issue to not. Uh, Give away a PS, right? He would say something yeah, like that. Yeah, he would right? say something like that, yeah. It's really... I know, I know who uh, we are, and I, I know what we look like and sound like and talk about and, and what our personalities are and all that stuff. But but does that guy have the least charisma of anyone that has ever been on camera ever? Well, here's what I'd say. Uh, years ago, you came up with a character, DJ Dr. Dan Wiles. <laughs> yeah. Who I think I'm the only fan of. I think only you're right. Fans. Um, Hello. You should launch that, a DJ Dr. Dan Wiles OnlyFans. That may be that in the cards for him. That would be very funny, actually. Um, <laughs> but if you don't remember, DJ Dr. Dan Wiles was Jesse yeah. with a, I believe it was a paper towel on your head as a kind of do rag. Yes. <laughs> you're making a, it sound a little bit worse than it was. Uh, I would no, say it was more I, of a bandana. I don't think I am. I don't think I am. I think that's what it was. <laughs> And uh, with like one tendril of hair coming out. And the joke yeah. was you were bald and all of the ad reads were things like bald guy combs, yeah. Uh, yeah. Rogaine or whatever. Um, and Matt Taibbi is DJ Dr. Dan Wiles, but like evil. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think he's maybe a little bit dumber too. I, I did have the... Um... I did. I'm looking at the picture here. Buttmaster just sent. There's a picture of me in that. But I. I'm gonna. I can I? Can I put that, this on the stream? Well, it's in public. I guess you might as well. Okay. It was the. Uh, it's a. I got a. <laughs> what that is is it's actually it's a bandana, but you don't have to tie the bandana. It's just like a, <laughs> just like a skull cap. But I didn't oh, well, know. No, how to, no. To be clear, right. I'm referring to when you literally took a paper towel and fashioned a do rag out of it. You did that as well. Yeah. All right. On a different well, I occasion. think those are. Those videos are all lost anyway, so it doesn't really matter what <laughs> you say. Tragically, they are, I think, lost. Yeah. No, I, th I think Facebook Live had a rigorous archival system set up, so <laughs> we just have to go and look. <laughs> I, I used to watch that. It'd be on a weekday, and I'd watch that as I was getting off work instead of working for the last half hour or whatever. That's so that, that was at my old job, and I was like, we were, we were trying to figure out what to do God. on Facebook Live, and I was like, oh, this Jesse guy's really funny. Why don't we just do something with him? And then it was this. Right. It was great. Right. One of the worst right. ideas you've ever had. And certainly. I will say, like, two other people at work thought it was very funny. Hey, well, there you go. So. And, and look at us all now. Look how wealthy and successful we are now. <laughs> <laughs> and all look how well Cafe's later. doing. Well, yeah. They're doing great, I think. Huh? Yeah. 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 What does that URL do right now? Which one? It goes Cafe to a web oh. like it goes to an under construction where it says cafe, what you need when you need it. Yeah. <laughs> Here, this, is, this is DJ Dr. Dan Wiles. <laughs> wow, is that a th is that a 301 number there? Looking good. That was big back then. That was that was a lot of viewers. Was that yeah. your weight at that time or what uh well <laughs> I'm sorry. That was too much even for me. Need mop and bucket at the I'm sorry. <laughs> I mean, listen. Listen, listen. Listen, okay? Let me explain something to you. All right? Okay. This is a scorpion and frog yeah. type situation. I, I, Corridor, I don't welcome back to the control months. over Thank it. You. It came in no, my you're head. Right. I was in that mode. Okay. I'm yeah. just going to take the picture off the screen because I think that's me. Oh, yeah, fuck. I think it's, it's you know what? Arm, and arm I'll okay, list, let me even the score down. a little bit. Take I think of the two of us, I'm mm. the one who's been closer to that weight and come back from it. Okay. Well, look. 
So you, know, you you get on camera for a little while and you go, oh boy. Yeah. Uh, yep. That's. <clears throat> I love it. Listen, we forget. <laughs> okay, Bob and Brian, you don't have to clip for it. You. Definitely take a look at this guy's <laughs> brand new from Kellogg's special. K oh my moment. god, he was reviewing Kellogg's moments. Well, special K wait, moments. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What are Kellogg's moments? They look like snacks. like healthy-ish granola bars, I think. Oh boy. Maybe. I did go to cafe.com, by the way. What's what's on? What, what do we got? It's sort of posed as a news site, sort of, uh, like, but it's all about pre. Oh, I forgot right. they rebranded. Yeah. And uh, I who's, guess the, I... who's the meat press guy? Chuck. Uh... Chuck Todd. I was gonna say. Either's... I was gonna say Chuck Liddell. <laughs> <laughs> a new direction for me to press. He just punches out anyone who disagrees with him. Yeah, I don't know. I might check that out. Um, um but David Gregory, maybe the former Meet the Press. Is that what you mean? No, it, it was it was Chuck. Yeah, because he's on Chuck stage. Todd. He's interviewing. It looks like uh, Kumail is on stage, and in a different oh. scene, uh, Chuck Todd is interviewing Preet, and then a lady I don't recognize is interviewing Preet, and then Preet is giving a speech. So this is all just like. Talks with Preet, uh, yeah. basically. Okay. Who is? Hmm? <laughs> Sorry, did you did you see the image that someone posted of you? Rarely do I ever want to say yes to that. Okay, I'm just yeah, gonna. You never want to say. Well, no, it's yes really it's that. really fucking funny, and I forgot about this. It's gonna be really blurry because it's like a thumbnail image. Um, but oh, wow, a blurry image of me. That's that's very interesting. <laughs> just uh, yeah, getting better and better here, okay, huh? Here we go. Wow, what else could be <laughs> happening to me tonight? They say Hillary has pneumonia. My only question, what was wrong with the old monia? Old monia. DJ no. mm -hmm. Dr. Dan Wiles. We were making like okay, memes like crediting you. That's that's what I'm talking about. Yes. The paper that's towel. That's exactly it, Jesse. <laughs> you see, did I not describe that, I think, quite fairly? I think you've been very unfair to me. <laughs> I think that's an accurate rendering of what you're wearing on your head. I think that's totally unfair. Should we bring back DJ Dr. Dan Wiles? I no. That. <laughs> he was a very funny character. Yeah. Stupid. He was good. Bald guy Combs. Um, remember bald guy bald Combs? Guy, I, I wish I could remember the other ad reads because they were like, yeah. Bald guy Combs. Uh, -huh. uh, hair growing powder. You know, like just shit like that. Yeah. You know? But it's it was, it was it was of course ironic, you know. And now here I am wishing I had some bald guy Combs and 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 hair powder. Yeah. It's kind of funny, yeah, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. I will say this. I I got the good head of hair of this. Oh yeah, these three you got, you got great hair. And you, you're putting us to shame, no doubt about it. And I, I'm just I'm coming off the porch a little bit to say that. That's fine. <laughs> you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, you know? you're cool. yeah. And you're tall. Yep. Handsome. And you're smarter than we are. Big cock. Um, no need to talk about the rest of my life. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alejandroid, boy. fifty months. Welcome back. Thank you so much. Uh, what was I gonna say, Jeff? Oh, uh, I gotta get back to the. I gotta get back to my job here, of course. So, uh, right. Yeah. Here we go. Another day at the office, you know. Luke, welcome back. What's Half up, Luke? Luke? You're knowing these two white guys, <laughs> Luke. Get out while you can. That's what I'm <laughs> I'm an old timer here at knowing <laughs> these guys. Yeah. And do not recommend Troll Uh thank uh, you, Luke. Six months. I'm gonna be on Luke's stream right after this as well, playing some Balatra. It's gonna be a lot of fun. And White Boy uh, White Boy with a do-rag, welcome. Thank you, Nana. White boy with a do-rag, welcome. Uh wow. Timbonic, I I have shown my face on all the YKS premiums. That's you, true. And uh And Block Party, and, I think, too. And Block Party, yeah. yeah. So fuck off. <laughs> I Very smell great. Do, so. 14 months. Welcome back. Thank you. I can't help you with the cereal shrimps, my friend. That's a different department. Cereal Fuck. shrimps. Enough about, eh, whatever. Who cares? Get... <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, you know. yeah, it's fine. Looks like uh, Preet's got a number of podcasts here you can check out on cafe.com. Love that. Love that. We've got Stay Tuned with Preet. I guess that's yeah. starring him. Yeah. Um, we've got Now and Then with Heather Cox Richardson and Joanne Freeman. Right, um, she's the biggest account on Substack, I believe. Are you being serious? I'm serious. Yeah, okay. I, I believe so. Yeah. Okay, great. Um, great place like to still be posting. <laughs> yeah. Looks she's like that's not a one of them, thing. but she also maybe yeah. get off there. You know. Yeah. Okay. 
There's also doing justice. Justice is about doing the right thing in the right way for the right reasons. And it's about making sure that no one is above the law. In each episode of doing justice, Preet Baraha, is that how you say it? Bra Preet, I think so. Yeah. Bra, Stefan, he signed your fucking checks. Barara, I, I think, think it's Barara. It I think it's Barara. Yeah. yeah. Explores the key elements of a case from the unique perspective of the prosecutor. So two, two uh, podcasts with Preet. Okay. We've got a third podcast, which is the Cafe Insider Audio Feed. Yeah, this is also going to be featuring Preet. Um, then we've got uh, the Cafe Insider podcast. That's the same thing. Those are two things he just put twice because he wanted six squares instead of five squares. Okay. Uh, and finally, this one will be interesting to you, Dan. This is up against the mob. I I have a story about this. Go on, though. Okay. <laughs> well, Preet's not on this one, so I got nothing. No, I know. I already know what you're going to talk about. <laughs> this, this no, by the I'm way ser- i have a story about this but re- g- but continue talking this is, well, this, just- is, this is the jesse picture i remember from D- the dj dr danwell's snapchat takeover yeah what are the only artifacts we have left i think of yeah it? and i believe it's- you got paid 15 dollars for this hey it's 20 <laughs> with inflation <laughs> it was 20 <laughs> <laughs> Oh boy! But well, man says those are nephew sunglasses. I know that all of that money went to sunglasses and do rags. So yeah. I didn't make a fucking dollar off the whole thing. No, but you got the sunglasses and do rags out of it. So yeah, remember right. how Bruno Mars is in fifty million dollars of debt at the casino? <laughs> he works at? <laughs> <laughs> with sunglasses and do rags <laughs> <laughs> in the gas station. <laughs> all right. Buying, uh, no, buying I, the JKM I, uh, Crave TV hats, the Yankees hats, where it says, like, just New York on it, and it's clearly supposed to be a Yankees shit. hat. That's how I knew. Uh, I don't think this episode has come out yet. Or it's the one we did with you, Stefan, when we did the um, we did the uh, the last big save. Yes. Um, out uh, this Friday. Out this Friday, yes, on oh, YKS Premium. I'm so jealous. Oh, boy. It was a you, lot of fun. It, it was a lot have of fun. Have you seen it or no? I have, yeah. You have, okay. Arguably his uh, worst movie. Um. Well, see, I like, geez. I like, I pushed back on this as well. I pushed back on this also. Wow, I'd really have to think about that, but I don't. I think the joke thief would be worse. But go uh, on. I'm sorry. I think the joke thief is worse, but I also do think that the last big save is mercifully short compared to his other like it crime. It seems epic. so much longer though, because the, like two thirds of it is an awful hockey game. I know, but the other ones are almost. I think the other ones are like two hours. The joke thief, yeah. he's in an Uber. No, I know, Remember but that? but at least yeah. you, at least you get to see the really bad stand up from that Canadian guy and Ed the Sock. And the uh, was it like a Playboy buddy? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. She was yeah. funny. She was great. Um, that being said, when I went to get uh that that uh that that sack of disgusting energy drinks that no one should ever and i poured oh them all God. out by yeah. the way i want you to know i did mm-hmm. pour them all Thank out you. i didn't I'm glad you did. those i'm glad you did um what what really struck me as funny there is the two guys who were in the convenience store uh m- motioning up to the the uh knockoff flat brims like on the top of the thing above the atm and the guy had to come over with a stick to get them down and sell oh them my <laughs> the, God, <man>. the, <laughs> The Man. bootleg hats, really good. Uh, all right, I can spill a little tea on mm. on the pre thing. Can I do this? Please. I've well, never talked about this. I actually don't know if you can because I did sign like an NDA when I got laid off there. So, you think that's how long do you think that fucking lasts? Oh, I don't know. It's probably fine. Well, it affects me. Oh, okay, right. that's so fine. Not, it's not about yeah, yeah. you, isn't you narcissist? Listen, <laughs> really. Um, I have never publicly talked about this. I worked for a few years at at a company that was part of Vox Media, which I think means I'm the only person who was employed there who was blocked by the Vox account. And nobody... <laughs> okay. Uh, no, no, no. That's great. Um, so, great. I flew under the radar on that. Terrific. But I remember shortly before I got laid off from there... Um, they acquired cafe and they had a like a zoom meeting okay where we all met pre yes and the other guy and i went into it like man fuck this guy he he got rid of my friend stefan he ruined my friend stefan's thing <laughs> except all the other co-workers on the zoom call 
were so checked out and disinterested that the little human part of me oh. that was still felt something was like, all right, I'll ask some questions because yeah. everyone else is being such a dick, you know? Oh, Honestly, geez. every time I met him, he was a really nice guy. So He was very nice. But then the other thing that happened was they brought the guy on who had the mob podcast. Right. That Jesse talked uh -huh. about. And I was very frustrated by that because I had been trying to convince my, like what my job was, was like in like development and, you know, all the, I was trying to convince him to do a mob podcast forever. Yeah. And then they brought, this guy was doing it and his deal was he had, and I'm not joking, this was his credit. He had tried to convict John Gotti Jr. in three trials and failed in all three. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> all right. Don't never uh, give up. Never give up. That's the lesson there. Well, get or give up after three, yeah. which is what they did. Yeah. You know. Fourth one would have been a real that slobber knocker, maybe. <laughs> so, so that's my little story there. And then wow. I got laid off. Uh, and that was the last time you got laid, wasn't it? Let's see. This might have been more recent. <laughs> 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 anyway, no need to go over the records on that one. No, no that's but, um, fine. That's so funny to but, not be able to convict the guy whose name is essentially Mr. Crime. Well, and it was yeah. a very, it was kind of a darkly funny. You know what the case was? No. The case was about whether he was responsible for ordering the shooting of Curtis Sliwa. Oh, who, that guy's, that guy ran for mayor, right? Yes, the Guardian Angels guy. Yes. Now, Jesse, you might not know this guy, <clears throat> but he was a... I'm not joking. He was a McDonald's manager in uh, the Bronx who in the 80s started a group called uh, the Guardian Angels who would wear berets and red, like, satin baseball jackets. Okay. And ride the subways with, like, whistles to try to protect people from being mugged. I have seen this. Yeah, yes. he's like a total psycho. Yeah. And he was okay. recently in the news. He was on Fox News in like Times Square and a mob of his guys started beating up a shoplifter behind him. Right. And saying, yeah. oh, he's an illegal immigrant or something like that. Right. It wasn't true. Yeah. Right. I don't think he was oh, even yeah. a shoplifter. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. So that's that's the story there. But he would also go on the radio and criticize John Gotti. Uh, so one day he got in a cab. <laughs> I mean, this is like, it's not funny, but it sort of is funny. Uh -huh. He got, he gets in a cab and a fat guy pops up in the passenger seat of the cab and starts shooting at him <laughs> into the back seat of the cab. Yeah. Jesus. And Curtis Sliwa jumps out the window like a cat. Uh -huh. He has a bunch of just, cats too, doesn't he? I think he's a cat guy. Yeah. And gets shot a bunch in his legs, but survives. So the trial was about whether John Gotti Jr. was responsible for that. And it rested on the word of this informant who, John A. Light, who the jury, I think he was eventually described as the worst witness in criminal <laughs> history. Like, he was not believed at all. And they put him on the stand three times. Final note on this, John A. Light is in every mob documentary on Netflix now. Wow. Where they bring him on to say, we were basically, you know, kings of the city. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Wow. And then, yeah. So that's my long story there. That's yeah. really good. That's wow. very good. Getting shot in your legs a bunch is kind of funny. It's, I mean, I knew if I framed it that way too, yeah. it would sound funny because it sort of is, you know? Yeah. Huh. Somebody clip Stefan saying that, so when it happens to him later, we can... Come on. Corey Kindness, welcome back. 54 months. Thank you. It might happen. Well, dropkick, thank you. And listen, I'll tease... Can I just... Can I do a tease? Uh, yeah, after yeah, this. Go for it, right now. <laughs> that, uh, oh, perfect. This is perfect. <laughs> listen. I know it seems like I haven't been doing shit lately, okay? Absolutely. Paisan, Absolutely. It feels like I've fallen off the map, all right? Yeah. A bada bing, bada boom, hey, you know? Doing the, Mike, the Mikey much. Miles voice. A lot voice. of complaining, though. Yeah. Have you heard his accent recently, Mikey Miles? Uh, how has it shifted? I'm curious. Oh, it's a lot... I don't even know how to describe this in a way that isn't offensive. 
No, Perfect. let's go there. Let's well, go there. Just go watch one of his most recent ones. He sounds he sounds very very different now. Hey, can is I just he say Thank you, Dark a Mike. note sorry, the most recent note from Preet is from August 2022 and it's called Understanding Monkeypox. Bro, you gotta run this shit back. It's been a long time. We understand monkeypox now. We got it. We get it. All right. Oh, uh, I think I get it. <laughs> right out there, man. <laughs> I'm that guy with the monkeypox. Uh, uh, yeah. 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 Uh, where so were you this done? time last year? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's true. A few weeks ago, Mikey said he's been mixing ammonia and bleach to clean his floors. I did see. Th I did get that update. Yeah. yeah. Um. That one came through. That one came through. Uh, you know, because I feel like my two sources for that. Mm. Or every few months, I remember to check on Mikey. Yep. Sure. And it's honestly the the spaces in that have been getting a little longer. Yeah. As he gets. That's... Uh huh. What? I seem dubious. Not at all. No, I think that's the right way. I mean, the right way to do it is to not pay attention to him at all. But. Well, but what I was gonna say is the second way I find out is from Stefan. Yes. Yeah. Right. I'll check the the Mikey Miles subreddit once in a while, you know. But it's been it's been slowing down a lot recently. I will say. Yeah. So. Wow. Yeah. Is he not doing enough wait, wait, drawings? Now, Jesse, what were you implying with your tone, though? Because you were definitely trying to communicate something, and I want to know what it was. Uh, no, I think it's like that thing where Coco was doing sign language, but it didn't really mean anything. <laughs> There's just like somebody on the other end was like, "Oh yeah, he's trying to say that Dan looks at the thing or whatever," but really, I was just like, I was just like flipping oh, out. I was like doing whatever. You just whatever. didn't care. I was just doing. You're like, just give me juice noises. fruit. I just yeah, want I juice fruit. I don't know what the fuck. I was looking at my I was looking at my pictures and stuff. I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, we just unlocked the production facility. Here we go. Let's do it. Let's go. That's really exciting. Yep. I'm gonna pretend this game is like a Scarface type thing, but with the different <sighs> businesses away. that Frank D'Angelo had. <laughs> <laughs> well then, let me share a bit of advice. Thank you, Mac. I could use, I could use some cheetah surge. Shredded wheat yeah. is indeed a better value by weight. But Hello, Demi. Many of the biscuits within are wholly That's right, Demi. Not true. A mess of now, what is this one? Powder, this is Pat doing an impression of, like, meat. an Elden Ring. Uh, <laughs> right. Like, uh, I was going to say, like, an Elden Ring sales guy. I don't think that's the right. Probably a, not the right. A merchant. Sales associate. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Elden Ring seems like something Dan could get into. Uh, I could see that. That's Lou Bega freak was Dan in the middle of telling us no. about a new project and Stefan derailed. I didn't, That's true, actually. I don't think yeah, I derailed you. True. I actually don't think I derailed you. Anyway, Dan, I I I would love for the chat to hear this. Listen, I've I, I've shared it on my stream a while ago, so it's still in the works that of me launching a podcast with some interesting folks. I can't quite announce it yet, but it's happening. So yeah, yeah. Stay, okay. And well, I, I I hope this is not saying too much, but you've told me a little bit about uh, what it's going to be about, and I'm just I'm really excited to hear your take on the uh, 90 Day Fiance universe. I I think it'll be cool to get your recaps and stuff like that of like who. Now that sound literally went through to cover up the one word I needed to hear in that. <laughs> <laughs> so I I need you to repeat it, and then I'm mm. going to act like I you know whatever. Oh wait a minute, my potatoes are ready. Hang on. <laughs> It's called the potato cast. <laughs> that's what it, that's what Dan's potato is going to uh, need once he's through with it. He's going to beat the shit out of it. He's going to beat its ass, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You're crazy. This game is fun. You it's gone from sucking ass to being fun. Well, I'm now really that excited. I'm driving the actual forklifts, it's pretty fun. Yeah. What do you got there? Some cat food? It kind of looks like a bunch of cat food. It could be a bunch of like maybe it's like mulch or something. Mmm, yeah, mulch is good. You know, could be some mulch. Gotta have my mulch. There's one more uh, area to unlock after this, so we're gonna we're gonna hopefully. Uh, and it's your penis. I need to unlock my penis from my cock cage. Oh, Libby says a bunch of mulch in Bellatro. That's right, Libby. Yep. Imagine we were playing Bellatro right yep. now. Yeah. Yeah, Tom. <laughs> well, Dan said cat, so... I, in fairness, and it was a funny observation to make that he's a he's a cat, you know, lady. Yeah. Let's not be too <laughs> fair to Stefan. You can be Fuck sort you, of fair Stephen. to me. Aw. Yeah. Um, 
so sorry, what were we talking? Oh, by the way, let me say this. You, Cassie Frago says Dan is signing on to the Club Random Network. Yeah. With Bill Maher. I mean, I'll tell you that I can't say it yet. Uh, the real answer of who I'll be working with is much crazier than that, right? Yeah. Um, so stay tuned. And Very possibly exciting. you won't uh, uh, like, <laughs> like it either, uh, but we'll see. Yeah. 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 Do you think that he's, uh, is he, is he going to be, uh, is his house going to still be uh, raided at that time? Are you going to be able to use the studio in his place? <laughs> well, uh, and again, without naming who I'm going to be working with, um, right. but well, let's come up with a name that he doesn't go by. Uh, so when I signed on with Puff Daddy, right? Right. Yeah. Um, what I said was, uh, what do what you, uh, I, I ponied up. I said, what do you got for me? Yeah. And uh, that was when Cuba Gooding Jr. entered the room. And so. And you said, yeah, you said, this is going to be one hell of a night. I No, what did I say? I said, show me the money. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Master T was now, 34 uh, months walking Now, now he did now, now, Cuba didn't pick up on that because he was zonked out of his mind on pink uh, crystals or whatever the fuck they were carrying. <laughs> but, but if he hadn't yeah. been, you got to imagine. It's, you know what? I was reading about that lawsuit and it seemed like, you know, like when they have drugs in a sci-fi movie or like yeah. Robocop 2 that doesn't exist. Yeah. Yeah. That's what it sounded like they were doing. Like, yeah, where they're eating pink Himalayan salt. What the, f yeah. sorry, what the fuck you know? happened uh, at the warehouse here? Uh, mm, oh, this looks like a case for Dan here. Uh, excuse me, my my wife loves your warehouse. I was just I just had uh, one more <laughs> one more question. <laughs> right? What 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 is the stuff called in? Uh, is it new? Blood. Oh. In Ro in <laughs> RoboCop. I think it was new. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're buying um, all these sci-fi drugs with, for like, with. They're buying it with credits. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. 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 The other one was the um, the newer Batman had an interesting one where it was like eye drops. Do you remember that? Yes. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. I yeah. thought that was pretty good as a yeah as a fake drug. Yeah. Well, you know. you, were, you were in the fucking tank for that movie. Oh, I love that movie. Yeah. You didn't like it. I did like it. I just oh, okay. think I think so other takes being a, such a other, bitch for other it? takes on Batman are totally valid. That's how I feel. I think the other Batman takes are fine. I don't think did it has I say, to be. Did I say anything about that? I just said oh, I here we go. really liked the movie. Here we go. Wow. Here we go. No, wow. no, no, no. Don't start shit. I, you're wow. starting shit. Wow, wow, wow. Look, it was pretty, it was pretty long. It was, it was a pretty long, it's a pretty long movie. Sure. Well, that's it. <laughs> so, so Christopher Nolan, known for his brevity. Wow. Oh. Wait. Wasn't that long? Those, hey, those ones come weren't on. this. What are you showing me? What are you doing? I mean, it was worth it for that alone. Ah, uh, he's yeah. great. Yeah, he's great. Well, it's called the Rada del Flada, or whatever. Remember, he yeah, schools yeah. him on the Spanish. Really Man. good. Oh come on, Jesse, you kill him! Oh stop it! <laughs> uh boy, drinking petroleum says sorry to be annoying, but why doesn't Dan stream lovely movies anymore by court order? That's not. <laughs> well, I was gonna say that's not true, but then I thought, you know, it could be though. <laughs> uh, the car chase was really good too. Car chase Fuck. was good, and the movie was good. The movie I was got good. you. I got you. Really good. God. Isn't there, are, are they, aren't they doing a show with? The... Yes, they are. Dude, yeah. Interesting. Good, What's that gonna good be on? Cast. Uh, Max. Oh right, yeah, because the uh, fucking WB, right? Yeah. Yeah, that'll probably be good. I think so. I'll actually watch that. I'll watch that shit. Yep. I'll watch that shit. Yeah. I, I listen. I think we got a lot of good TV. We got a lot of Dan TV coming. Yeah. This year we got that. We got Shogun. Yep. And then we got a, a show. I'm very. I, I don't think either of you will be interested in, but I will be. Maybe Stefan. Uh, Ripley, which is. An adaptation of the talented Mr. Ripley books. Oh, I'll watch that for sure. Oh. Featuring the uh, the priest from Fleabag. Yes. As, uh, so I'm mm. I'm very excited for that. I'll watch that. Have you now, I'm interested to get your take on this because I've been enjoying this show, but I know the guy who like wrote the book it's based off of is maybe something of like a fabulist, but Tokyo Vice. 
Yeah, um, I've not seen that. Okay, mm. I'm really and enjoying it. All the all the stuff with like, all the stuff that doesn't involve, what's his name? Who's the main the whoever the main actor is? All Al Gore. Yeah. Uh, well, no, is it him? No, oh, is well, it? It's one of those guys. Do you mean the real name? Is it? The real name is, is it? Jake Adelstein. Jake Adelstein. Yeah. Um, it's not like bad or anything, but I I think he's like Ken, Ken Watanabe is the best part of it for sure. Right. But I'm enjoying the show. I am enjoying the show. Well, the, you know, the article I, I wrote, um, it's being adapted by the, some of the writers from that show. So we'll, we'll okay. see if anything comes of that. I, I think you should watch the show because I think you will. I should. I mean, yeah. I meant to after I heard that. So, yeah. you know. Yeah. Man, why didn't you? I guess I got busy. <laughs> uh, that's just, I'm just kidding. That's not true. Eh, I actually life. don't. I I don't. I'm not saying this to sound like a snob because I I'm I'm not I'm not, but I actually just don't watch that much TV anymore. I don't watch that many TV shows. You know. Come on, Babel. Nah. Come on, on Babel. Neither does Dwayne, really. Hey, thanks, Mac. What do you think Dwayne watches? God. Well, you can hear most of it uh, if you watch any of his videos or if you're na his neighbor. <laughs> yeah, that's, that would probably do it, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, people, multiple people in the chat saying porn, porno. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Whatever he's watching, it is at absolutely maximum volume. That's right. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. You ever have a neighbor? Probably Jesse never has, but Stefan, you ever have a neighbor who had that issue? Good question. Uh, I mean, I've I've lived with people who have the TV volume up extremely high. Uh, <laughs> do I mean, was not going do you, in do that you mean, direction. Do you mean like watching porno though, specifically? No. I, again, interesting your mind went there. Okay. Uh, I just... Hmm. I don't, not really. I really haven't had any like horrible neighbor situations. We had that this, really uh, turned out to be an inkblot test for Stefan to... <laughs> we to had a... Uh, some stuff. In our... Or no. In, uh, in fir the first year or second year of college, we, we got a house and there was a guy living in the basement who was like f fucking crazy. And like went mm -hmm. completely nuts uh, halfway through the year because we were partying all the time. Uh, so that was pretty funny. Well, you sound like the bastard to hear. <laughs> he, well, look, he, he did the, the mistake of being like, hey, guys, I know I'm, I'm kind of supposed to be in charge here. Like the, the first week of the year, I'm supposed to be in charge here. But I want to I let you know that I'm kind of the cool guy. Uh, yeah, and you, we, can, okay. we can smoke weed together. We can hang out. And it's like, OK. So he's sort of. He fucked up at the beginning of the year, I think. So you're victim blaming. That's yeah, correct, I really yeah. still don't get are you gonna say something that makes you not seem like a psycho asshole? At, some at one point he drove his SUV around to the backyard and uh, put his high beams on into my friend's uh, bedroom window at three in the morning and started honking his horn for like an okay, hour. What was your friend doing? Uh, he had been playing some music like earlier. Okay, so, man. Well, <laughs> look at like, <laughs> at like 11 p.m. on a Friday. No, so, you're in the wrong. Yeah, <laughs> I, I I hate to agree with Jesse on this, but Jesus. that guy got that guy was getting you back. Mm. Uh, you, you guys started, he fucking finished it. Mm. Yeah, mm. that's what I like. Mm. I'm with that guy. Mm. I, well, also, I, I'm realizing now there's a lot of things I like can't say. <laughs> anyway, uh -huh. he, he was not a good guy. I'll just say that. Oh, and also the guy was Kevin Spacey. Yes. Oh, still cool. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. 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 Hey, Stefan is uh, fine with me if you want to smoke pot or however he <laughs> talks, right? Oh, at one point he, you know, we had those uh, those magnets on on our fridge that you, they were like words and stuff, and you could spell stories with them. And right. we came back from school one day, and all of them were removed except for three that said "Watch your back." All right, can I be real with you? That's so cool. I mean, it was it, it was kind of yeah. it was a pretty cool thread. Yeah. Yeah. That it. is like some '80s erotic thriller yeah. shit. Cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, It'd be funny if Stefan did that, and it was <laughs> like he comes in and sees the magnets, and it just says like "poop piss," shit, <laughs> you know. Some little dork was here. <laughs> yeah, he was here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we, I, I can't remember. We had a, we had a, we had a bad neighbor also. Um, but I think he was maybe just like the guy that you were describing yourself as because right. even at that age, 
you know, my wife and I were old and yeah. wanted to be left alone. I, I, I want to um, be clear. I wasn't the loud guy in the situation because there were like yeah, th- three of were, us you living were there. No, I just in a bed. I stayed in my room and played computer. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. So you you were just following orders. Correct. Huh? That's right. That's right. Uh-huh. That's right. Uh-huh. Um, Jesse, I feel like you have had a lot of distance between you and your neighbors for the most part, though. That's true. Um, but in college, um, the, yeah. for the first hard year, to avoid we, sometimes. We did Yeah. Yeah. We, we lived in a place that was like uh, it was a condo that was specifically built for the purpose of uh, hosting out of town alumni uh, so that oh. they could have their condo there and then step out their uh, back door and walk over to Neyland Stadium. Uh, through the mm-hmm. woods. That's mm-hmm. fucking crazy. It was crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. Um, and so you means... you lived there as like a student, though. Right. Yeah. Okay. And it was so it wasn't all it wasn't like full up because if anyone even owned those places, they weren't there really. Right. Right. Um, and uh, and I think like the the like I guess the lady was like a superintendent. I guess kind of. Um. And because she lived like downstairs, but then also sort of was in charge of the whole thing. Right. Mm-hmm. And uh, but then she had a uh, like a Mustang driving boyfriend who was like a real sack of shit and an idiot and a loud bastard. Um, and he would like, you know, he would be out there. Hey, I'm in, co- you know, it's college time. Let's all drive our cars and drink and play music and stuff. And I was just like, you know, I'm just. How old was this guy? 40. I have absolutely no way probably 40 yeah, yeah probably okay and uh i think it you know, matters that he's a lot older yeah you know and i'm sitting here and going hey i'm 19 can we like keep it down please yeah yeah that's a bad situation to be in it's annoying you yeah. know i'm trying to figure out how to get the stacked washer to work it's it's not oh yeah it's not draining properly Oh, I, I love hearing about like young jesse and it's like you see the seeds of the later character oh yeah. you know it's 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 like uh you know al capone fighting over the kid stealing his sandwich at, it was my at, you know my favorite part of living there is when we got to take the stacked washer dryer out and push it off the balcony onto the ground oh yeah yeah because i was so tired of it as an appliance yeah can i tell you something my dad had to do once in my great-grandmother my great-grandmother was moving uh to a nursing home there was what was in the basement of her house that had been there probably since the 1950s. There was no way of getting out. Your dick. Just guess. Was, now, it, what, was it your dick? It was not my dick. I don't think that would work. Okay. Would it, do, it, do, it doesn't. Okay. Lucky guess. <laughs> <laughs> Lagrade got it. A piano. Oh, Ooh, God. Yeah. Boy. Okay. Yeah. So. What did my father do? And I will remember mm. till the end of my days the sound. He beat the fucking thing into pieces with a <laughs> wow. sledgehammer. Oh, that's really wow. good. Wow. And the sound was incredible. And then he hauled it all out in uh, um, contractor bags. So what a pain in the ass. I mean, that's still a huge job and really it annoying. Was, um, I'm a, listen, my dad, you know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know if you guys can relate to this of like, how are we, how are we the same species? Yeah. For yeah. Sure. yeah. Like, how can you, like, he just, my dad needed to build a deck once. So he just built it. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Like I was Not really impressed. Ass. I figured out my dishwasher had an air gap. Oh, like, yeah. that, that, that is impressive. That's impressive. Well, don't don't that sell yourself like, short. I'm, yeah, really. I'm unlocking the mysteries of being that, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Did I, um, did I tell a story on here about, um, there was a party at, at college and, uh, it was at my friend's house and they lived in like a cul-de-sac with like, I would say half the houses there were like college guys and half were like old retired couples. just like a horrible right. combination. Yeah. Bad right. combo. And they did the, they did the classic, uh, college guy thing of like, Hey, we're having a party tonight. We let's go to our direct next door neighbor who we know doesn't really like us that much. And let's give them a bottle of wine. And they bought like, you know, like. A twenty-dollar bottle of wine, right? By the way, Canadians operate very differently on this front. Come on, already. that that would happen here. It's, it's in like some. it's like the but it's the it's the thing you do where you think it's like foolproof. You're like, okay, we bought them a twenty-dollar bottle right. of wine. They can't get mad right. at us now for anything. Right. 
And oh, they love their so, wine, so they yeah. did that. They're like, here's our here's our number. If anything comes up, just let us know. And yeah. it was like fine, and like the party went pretty late and everything, and they didn't hear from the neighbors, and they're like, okay, that was that was good. And then they get a call the next morning, and someone, I guess, leaving the party at like 3 a.m., <laughs> had shit their pants, <laughs> and okay. then taken their pants, their underpants off, and thrown the shitty underpants on the guy's car. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that's about. What, what's that joke in Brass Side? This was the one thing you yes. didn't want to happen, you know? <laughs> that's like, yeah, that's worth a call. Yeah, you know, I of think all the so, things. Yeah. You know. yeah. <laughs> uh, and and sorry to hear Murder Brian wasn't feeling well. That was <laughs> <laughs> one too many caramellos. Well, it was college though. It was, yeah. Getting a little crazy, you know. We well, got crazy with yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. This game is this game fucking rocks. Can't be pooping on somebody's car. <laughs> no, you can't. Well they they poop their pants. I think we are splitting hairs. Yeah, ass hairs. Ugh, with poop. Sp <laughs> splitting pants. Yeah. yeah. Oh gross. Yeah. And the poop comes out of the pants. Dude. <laughs> Party foul. <laughs> yeah. No, I don't think they ever found out who it was. Um but yeah. Wow. Uh, mystery of mystery. the poop. Yep. In, in my new Ghostbusters sequel, uh, one of the old guys shits on podcast. <laughs> Jesse, on can, you, can you read Tom's message, Jesse? If you threw Brian's <laughs> shitted in underpants, they would crash the windshield like a brick in a newspaper. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, boy. I really think, not to get too gross... Uh -huh. As time goes on, there is more of a link between mental health and how your shitting is going. Oh, 100%. Than we talk about. Absolutely. I feel, you that. Know? I feel that. Look at Trump and think about the mental anguish he's right. under all day and that he lashes oh. out at others. And he's taking the worst shits possible, right? They must be. And I'm talking that stacks for years. Yeah. Right. Because he's yeah. been like that probably since the 80s. Right. Well, when is yeah. the last time you took a normal shit? I'm going to say, like, Gerald Ford was, was <laughs> making moves. Oh, you my God. Know? Right? Because he got yeah. married. I think he, what, he got married late 70s. Yeah. He could, he could start letting go then. All right. Yeah. Don't need to take care of myself so much anymore now. I got Ivana. It's very funny I'm imagining sad. there being a point where Trump said that. <laughs> Yeah, but maybe he didn't put it quite that way. Sure, yeah. <laughs> but uh, but do you ever watch old? There. Do you ever watch old videos of him though, where he um, he's like lucid. He's like, what happened to this sleaze? I mean, he was still a sleaze. Oh bag, yeah, but like he could talk. He could talk. Yeah, all right. He Ugh. felt he felt slick, in a way yeah. that there he is not. He is no longer. He's not slick, slick now. That's that's a good way. Of well, the thing him, he's yeah. doing now that is like sort of worrisome is how much he's cursing. Mm -hmm. That yeah, seems like, like he's really losing it because he never really cursed no decorum before. decorum for the office. Yeah. yeah. Well, of course. Yeah. <laughs> well, but no, it's true. Like that was like the one thing he wouldn't do for some reason. Yeah. Yeah. And then he's like, jo "Fuck Joe Biden," and you're like, "That's kind of funny," but I'm more alarmed by it than anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, Tom. <laughs> 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 well, our Box was really. It was incredible what Steve Albini did! Yeah. <laughs> and Steve Albini, he doesn't take any royalties. He doesn't take any royalties off the bands he produces. <laughs> very, very interesting. <laughs> you know, not a great Trump, but, you know, it's, it's oh, pretty come good. On, come on, hey, it's come good. On, hey, it's come good. On, it's, a great, it's a great Trump. I feel great. like I've been doing this thing of, like, jokingly fishing for compliments but then i just realized it just sounds like that's what i'm i just sound like a narcissist i just sound awful it's okay you know, to it do feels, that though. it feels good to get it, a compliment. it does feel good to get a compliment yeah that's exactly it jeff hey th hey thanks man hey thanks well, i don't I think, like feeling i don't good. think he was complimenting you but oh <laughs> oh i'm sorry <laughs> yeah dan's santa voice is very good well i i was really just imitating jesse's santa voice as i recall Oh boy! Wow, that's all other thing. 
No, I'm serious. I remember you went on you went on blocked party first. Yeah. And hello, yeah. Stefan. Right, like you know, the, the the reprieve of the asshole, just not having any. I, at that time, I don't even think I really knew Stefan very well at all. No, that was the first time I ever talked to you. That's insane. Is that true? Yeah. Yes. Really? Yes. And how what, is that possibly true? What might have been? Well, because we didn't have the stream then or anything, and right. Uh. I don't think we were even in like the a group chat at that point. That's crazy. Yeah. Right. Have we ever publicly disclosed what started the group chat? Oh, I think we important. have. It's really funny. All right. All right. No, you can, not important. you can say it, I think. Dan, I give you my uh, blessing. I, I, mm, you're, you're not the one I'm most concerned about here on that. I don't care. Well, right. people know it, it was yeah, yes, it was yes. Jesse's lawn. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Which was fine, by the way. It was not. It I was mean, just a funny. It wasn't the lawn. It was the driveway. It was the clippings on the driveway. But I mean, it, it looked like it, it, it looked okay? like a fucking lawn. Well, I blew it off afterwards. It's fine. Oh yeah, John. Oh, you, John Hendren called in to blew say off it your once. Yeah. Yard work. Yeah. No, yeah. I didn't. I didn't. I did. I. Hey, no rush on finishing that. I mean, that was that was how it started. Well, <laughs> and there was another thing, a certain that's, recipe, which that's not yeah. important. either. Oh, yeah. Which isn't important. Yeah, yeah. not important at all. Yeah. Um, but I, I'm sorry. The reason I even mentioned it is I started laughing a yeah. lot just now. The, the recipe it. was so the it was my scrumptious uh, cookies that I put pudding mix in for some reason. <laughs> As the I, I think uh, I think we can say our friend Merritt uh, described him as the inventor of cookies once. Yeah. And I've not been able to get that. All right, Jesse's not comfortable with this. With this <laughs> he, Jesse, Jesse's doing the face a white guy makes when he smiles I, at you as you're walking by. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how up on on some of these things everyone mm. is, because I haven't been able to watch the stream as much lately. Mm. We've definitely you're referenced doing, that guy on here before. Even busy, busy cooking potatoes and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Don't mm -hmm me. That is when <laughs> that's when like the the girlfriend is mad at you and won't say why. <laughs> don't do that to me. Yeah. <laughs> TV. <laughs> psycho. DB is a psycho. DB is. Like, why would you bring that up? <laughs> do you know? Do you know what I would have to do? You know what I have to say to get him to join at this point? You know what I would have to do? He was already on with Howl for two hours or whatever, watching some in, inscrutable dog shit. <laughs> do you know what I'd have to do? do? You know what to say to ask Mike to talk to me for another two hours tonight? There's not another word left in that man's body. <laughs> hey, it is. Yeah. It's it's eight oh one p.m. Also, JF. So we can uh, well, whatever. Well. Hey, I'm going to be going on Luke's stream right after this, so let's raid Luke. Who uh, cares? Dan, thank you so much for coming on. This is great. We got to we got to do this again. This was this is wonderful. The pleasure was all mine. Pleasure. <laughs> we need Mitch on to say pleasure again. Well, yeah, I know. Oh, yeah. I I was thinking of Mitch's this is making me randy or whatever the <laughs> you know. Remember that voice? Whatever that crazy bastard was. Oh, loves Mitch to say. is so yeah. crazy. Thank you lesbian twerker. 25 months. Welcome, Welcome back. back. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, okay everyone, go say hi to Luke and me and we'll see you tomorrow for the last day of store week. We got some cool oh, stuff planned for tomorrow night. Find out how Stefan absolutely fucked me. I sewered Jesse. He's going to be so happy on tomorrow night's oh, stream. Ooh. So you don't want to miss it. He messed up big time. I didn't mess be, up. I planned this out. I didn't That's mess this so up. Great. I planned you this out. You guys are going to be mad nope, too. Nope, I can't wait nope. for this. It's going to be fucking funny. All right. Bye, it's everyone. It's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> uh, what is the... All done my stream. All done my stream. I'm sick of this filth and I...